All right. Well, we are back. Well, we're back at the Nine Club Experience, episode 63. Getting there. 63. That's a lot of episodes. Si- yeah. Who's that? St. Kelly. Ain't Kelly. It's not Kelly. Whoa, bro. <laughs> <laughs> He's laughing all the way from Brazil. Yep. This is true. He got a juicy mouth. <laughs> juicy mouth. <laughs> I'd like to welcome Rick Kosick yes. back on the show. Yes, thank oh, you. Oh, you were Round of applause? Yeah, hold on, yeah. hold on. We Rick have Rick Kosick. There back. it is. Yes, you know? thank you for having me back. <laughs> Filling in some some big shoes for this episode. Listen, bro, you better have read up, Ugh. watched up. I don't have my milk. No, you want <laughs> you want mine? No, thank you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody's got to have the milk. Okay, you know. <laughs> what? Oh, Nothing. Okay. Rick, <laughs> thank you so much, dude. When we when you were on the show here on your episode, what episode number? Do we do we know what episode number that was? It's like twenty three weeks ago. Huh? It was like three weeks ago. A couple of weeks ago, right? 151? Could be. Something close. 161, maybe. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, because we're close on the experience. Yeah. Regular show, so yeah. We're 160, 160. Anyway, you were, uh, we said, you know, hey, come back. You had a, such a, we had such a great time with you. He said, come back anytime, you know, and here you yeah. are. Wow. It just happened out of thin air. I got a call from Kelly. He said, hey, I need someone to fill in. I'm going to Brazil. Yeah. And I said, I'd be gladly to do it. And plus, too, you on the Nine Club here, on your interview, you said that you were a big fan of Steezus. And he's right here. Here. Yeah. Right. In the Look flesh. You. I think <laughs> power of the universe. We, yeah, got right? our, we got a vibe over here in this corner, and then we got our three-way candle burning. Yes. It smells delightful. <laughs> it smells really good. It's actually making me hungry. I thought somebody was baking something here. I don't know what it I is. I thought about bringing him a candle as a, you know gift but i just didn't want to bring the wrong scent i know he has <laughs> he has his style that you know in things he prefers you know hey I, I, it's the thought that counts though yes but scents know? are important it is scents are true. important I, I, somebody I, likes lilac but they don't like lavender is a, what's jesus likes the vanillas right you like the vanilla base i like the dessert dessert base yes. what, is, what let's what is it uh we're burning a nice pumpkin pecan waffle you know it's crazy too because it smells amazing and then as soon as you said that Smells exactly it. like that. It smells I've really good. It you smells know, like it's, cookies or something. Tomorrow is the first day of fall. Ooh. Side note, also my birthday. Oh, it's your birthday what tomorrow. What the yes. fuck? So, How come you don't tell us these things, yeah, bro? You, we could have had a cupcake for you. I just did. Take my milk. <laughs> no, I, I don't think that. No. Is, no. Okay. Happy um, fucking birthday, dude! Well, no. Thank you. As yes. of when people are viewing this, it was Two Monday, days ago. but yeah. it's you know it's all good. But yes, birthday you know, week. I had to. Uh, oh, we got to get the the basic bitch going. You know, it's, <laughs> it's here. It's here. It's, Even I though it doesn't smell feel it. like it in here, <laughs> it smells like it. It smells like. <laughs> it. Now, Rick just brought up a good point. Are you a birthday week guy, or are you just the day? I didn't even tell you I know, until now. True. So no. Well, it's the beginning of the week. That's true. No, yeah. I don't. I don't celebrate no. birthday week. Some people are birthday month people. Uh, yeah, that's, I think that's, that's a girl a thing. Little I think it's yeah. That's more on the the, the female, female side of things. Man. I don't think we really do that. Twenty two years old. You don't look a day over twenty one. Wow. <laughs> Appreciate that, yeah, bro. Of course, man. Thank of course. you. Bro. Thank you. Talk shows keep you young. <laughs> they say skating <laughs> does, but I think it's talk shows. Talk shows are the fountain of youth, <laughs> especially right here in the Nine Club Experience. <laughs> oh, <laughs> give us that plug. Yeah. Listen, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Rick, thank you again for coming in. Yeah, and for Kelly, this is amazing. We're so stoked to have you here. Seriously. Yeah. yeah. Well, thanks for you know I I you know maybe we should just I got a gift for you guys. You got okay. Should we, we try to break it out now? Bearing gifts right out. Yeah. Right break it out. I mean, we is lo- it too much too soon? No, we love gifts. All right, hold on a second. We love gifts. He's reaching down there. He's grabbing his bag. He's unzipping it. It's like a Swiss Army bag. Yeah. Yeah. It's got lots of pockets. It's pulling out a... Let's see how big this thing is. Here is a... Oh, who wow. wants to open it? Look at, Look at this. this wrapping. It's from Trader Joe's. It yeah. looks like I picked you something up from Trader Joe's. <laughs> I thought the studio might need a little something, Tom. 
Who wants to open it? Is that their orange Steezus? chicken? Steezus? Pretty I'll, good. I'll, Steezus, I'll, open it up. Steezus, but this is for the ninth club. It stays here. But so Okay. Yeah. Uh, so get, basically guess, what you're saying is I, I can't take this home with you. You can take it home. <laughs> you know, you got to have a, you know, you, we'll talk about it after you open. All right. <laughs> Let me guess. You finally found the photo of the one you took of me on the bank. Is <laughs> that right? Well, I'm not going to. No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. Let's so, see, boys. What we got? Let's see. Let's, uh, I, the, I just want to say, I like how thoughtful you were. Even though it's a Trader Joe's bag, it was very well put together. Mm, yeah. yeah, you know, got to make sure it's wrapped. That's right. <laughs> That's right. Let's see here. Right. Plenty of tape. Yeah, I'm Opening. trying to get through this. you need a knife, Steezus? I or? should be good. I think uh, I'm just trying not to make too much noise. No, you got it, man. All People right. like to hear the unboxing. Oh, shit. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> Wow, look at this. Oh, wow. shit. Shit. Uh, it's a shit book. <laughs> That's yeah. amazing. I got you guys a shit book. So the Thanks. next time you have nice any other shit. big brother guy on the show, <laughs> you can research a little better. Okay. There R you go. Whoa, Rick. Just wow. What are you saying? Are you, <laughs> are you saying, saying that I didn't just because I didn't watch the movie? <laughs> I'm just, it's a helpful, it's just a helpful tool. It's all. Okay. Okay. <laughs> well, we it's got everything. We appreciate this that. This is yeah. sick. Thank you so much. Look at Hell that yeah. shit book. Here. Big brother book. Remember? This is for the uh for the frame grab. <laughs> <laughs> Twenty seconds. <laughs> you could put that behind there you go, yeah. Steezus man. Thank you, Rick. You're That's welcome. Awesome. That's awesome, man. Do they still make those or is that uh, out of print? They're out of print. Okay. The uh the publisher was Ginkgo Press, so mm. maybe anyone who's watching this maybe write to them and if there's enough people who want it, maybe they'll redo it again. I don't know. I was a big fan of Ginkgo Biloba for a while. I would take that. <laughs> It's for the mind. Memory. It's for memory. Yeah, yeah. I take it all the time. You still take ginkgo biloba? Yeah. Hmm. Interesting, Raj. Yeah. I didn't even know it existed anymore. Yeah. Just like the print company. <laughs> I do charcoal. If I had Whole Foods, charcoal mm, activated for the, charcoal. for the mind. No, for the stomach. <laughs> no. I was gonna say that's good for hangovers. I don't know about for brain fog. I thought eating helps. ginger helps for the stomach. It yep. absolutely yeah. does. Yep. Well, listen, let's get this show started, bro. We got a good. Well, we got a raffle. You know. Later in the show, we're going to pick a winner for the New Balance Numeric Raffle. We got uh, Tyler Suri's shoe, the 868, no and uh, a, a, a zip-up hoodie and a shirt. We're going to raffle that away later in the show. This episode, we have you know our good friends over at Skater XL. Man, we 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 they've in, they made the courthouse you know in their game. A lot of people did the who was that night speeds. He did a uh, whole Chris Roberts at the courthouse. Redid all my tricks at the courthouse. Wow. Night speeds. You find on YouTube? Yeah, I got on YouTube. Bro. How's that game going? Do you, do you get like it's a going update? good? Yeah, yeah. good. They're, they're actually um, they're a great job. Yeah, the game's going to be released on Xbox One and Nintendo Switch in 2020. Really? Oh. Yeah. So wow. they're making their. It's available now on Steam, which is the PC. Mm -hmm. You know. Um, early access. I don't know. It's a whole thing. Are, Are you, you one, one of the characters? Mm -hmm. What? Who is it? Huh? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> you want to know if you're a character, and I want to know if it's like a streaming platform. I wish I was a character, and yeah, it's stream. Uh, well, I think they download it. I don't yeah, think it's streaming. It's, I think they download it on their PC, and then they... Yeah, Steam is like the store where they can go and download games gotcha. onto the PC. Mm -hmm, so mm -hmm. what I was trying to say is, are you one of the characters? I wish. Oh. I wish. Maybe one day. Why can't yeah. there be like a nine club like crew? Mm -hmm. This is a great question. Mm -hmm. yeah. I'll have to ask them. Yeah, why not? They're good people over Absolutely. there. Absolutely. You know what, Rick? It's just a bunch of skaters that just There's got together yeah. and made a game. But doesn't mean they can't like make your characters. No, this, this is true. <laughs> this is one hundred thousand percent true. They could be like on the yeah. side, like commentary, like oh, we're talking about these. Things. <laughs> I should voice over the whole game. That'd be yeah. great. <laughs> but they they made fifty of these boards. Mm -hmm. They know they none will be made again. So. I made 50 of these boards. It's a courthouse stage here. Look at that. Oh, shit. Yeah. Nice. Long. If you want, you can color me in. Just doing my nice. switch flip manual across <laughs> there. But they made 50 of these. And uh, it's only, I don't know. It's, I don't know where else is available. But we're giving away three. <laughs> three of them to three lucky winners that we'll pick tomorrow. And, hold that, Rosh. Wait, won't we pick tonight? Oh, for the... Um, Oh, New Balance. So we'll pick next. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Yes. You said tomorrow threw me off. I know the whole Sorry. thing throws it's me just, off every weird. time. I we've done so many of these and I still don't know what's going on. We got uh, 
Yeah, we need Kelly here, though. <laughs> also, too, a skater ex. Oh, that one's so. Shut funny. up, Kelly. Guys. Yeah, no, seriously. <laughs> Tell him, Sneezes. Shit. Oh, I think he's having a real good time in Brazil right now. For I, sure. Uh, he's, uh, probably. We all know what he's doing down there. I hope yeah. not. Skater XL. This is a, um, a a bottle opener. And it's a USB. And it has the game oh. included on Let the USB that stick. Thing? That's so sick. Wow. So three in one right here. So board, USB stick, bottle opener, and with the game included. And some Skater XL stickers. Like I said, these are good people. We just want to support them and they're, what they're doing. That's think pretty it's amazing. genius. Yeah, that's, that's smart. <laughs> I like that. That's some good marketing. Yep. That's a good marketing. Bro, you want to download something and then open up a beer. Right? Yeah. Why does it got to be beer? I don't know. Could Go, be, you could open up some pop. You can open up a, could, <laughs> some pop. <laughs> <laughs> a nice club soda. <laughs> pop. Haven't heard that in a while. That, well, you got to go out and do different state. For yeah, that. that's some, that's what we say in the Midwest. Yeah. Yeah. I say pop. I had to retrain myself to say soda when I moved out here. Really? Because everybody would be like, what the fuck? It's soda. <laughs> <laughs> Open up a cool pop. <laughs> so anyway, Skater XL, we're going to pick a winner for the Tyler Surrey New Balance package later in the show. And then next week, we'll pick a winner for that Skater XL Amazing. package. Good people. Like I said, a bunch of skaters. Just doing their thing, just creating this whole skateboarding game. Really smart people too, because that's yeah. no easy feat. They're amazing. Like that's that's a lot of coding and a lot of effort that goes into that. So, yeah. and you know what's rad is the community around it it's is blow, is blowing up. They're mm -hmm. building worlds into the game. Yeah, just regular skaters, Rick. Yep. How long have they been working on it? A couple of years, maybe a yeah. year or two. Well, that. I can barely add, Rick. And these people are putting in <laughs> fucking levels in the game. That's a lot. That's a lot of work. Yeah. There's kids that put Shane O'Neill's backyard skate park into the game. Mm -hmm. Wow. And every, it's like damn near identical. It's, to it's the wild. T. Yeah. It's yeah. insane. Shout out to people that are multi-talented. You know what I'm saying? Exactly. That Thank would, you, Dubs. <laughs> thousand percent. Also, I feel like this has been, I, I just love having Rick here. This is such a, you know. Yeah, thank you. This yeah. is great. <laughs> this is it's great. an honor to fill in Kelly's corner. Kelly better watch out, bro. You may come back next week, too. Chris likes it because Kelly's not here. <laughs> <laughs> and he can control Kelly's laughter. <laughs> yeah. But, you know, he's kind of blowing up. I saw his commercial today. Oh, his oh, little um, trick of the SLS. Year. Trick of the year. Yeah, you know, he's sitting in that fancy Hollywood Hills house. And Trick of the year changed his life. Yeah, it definitely Trick, did. Trick of the year. Yeah, he's blowing up. <laughs> <laughs> Kelly. You all right? Yeah, the, <laughs> a little the indigestion. La, the LaCroix. You don't want to get stuck. I don't. You try I, to burp I, it. I don't drink them. Any type of burp, though, Steezus. <laughs> you know, when you drink beer, how about your, your Modelo? Doesn't the Modelo. Modelo burp ever get stuck? No, there's not too many bubbles in here. Hmm. Hmm. How about that white claw? Hmm. Mm. He doesn't know. He never, <laughs> <laughs> never got the box, so I can't tell you. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh. Anyway, dude, before we get into the skate topics real quick, I want to talk about something something rad that we, we came up with, Raj. Oh, I know you're talking about now. Yeah. We are, you know, me and Raj had a meeting the other day. You know, mm. without us, very rare. Yeah, of course, we have meetings all the time in wow. the conference room. Yeah, wow, yeah. which is the living room where the TV is. The den, right. yeah, the den. <laughs> but no, we were talking about in the last episode. We were talking about new merch and all this stuff, and you know, we need to get it. And we did graphic designer and all this shit. And lo and behold, I mean, we probably got like twenty five emails with I people, bet. DMs, all of the above, of people wanting to help us with graphics mm. and you know, just not even for money you know just they want to support the show i mean we i feel like the we just have such a strong community around us yeah. raj you know all these people why don't it's you amazing. make it a competition well rick not really a competition per se mm -hmm. but we thought it'd be cool to get submissions of artwork from our fans you know and um you know like a 1000 shirt or you know, uh, with some the shirts Jesus is wearing. You know, he's yeah. he's wearing his own shirt over there. I'm my own number one fan. <laughs> 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 but you know what? We thought it was we thought it'd be really cool if the fans could submit. It's awesome. Artwork. Their art yeah. to us, and we can make them into shirts, or we can make Hell them yeah. into mugs, and we can you know do whatever you know. Just 
I mean, the people who sent us emails and DMs were so gracious. You know, they were like, well, I don't want anything. I just want to help the show. I love the show. So we created a um, page on our website mm-hmm. where you could upload artwork to us, you know, and um, it's awesome. We'll pick a few for this next run of stuff we're doing. Yep. That's dope. Yeah. Yeah, that's great. Thought it was cool, right? Absolutely. I think we should also incorporate the fans too and let the fans maybe pick one design as well, like one of their favorites. You know what? I thought about that. I thought about like, and I'll look into it, mm-hmm. you know, but I think there's like uh, voting things that we could put on our website yeah. too, you know, and put all the, you know, put our picks we up there. Yeah, exactly. We could do Instagram too, you know. I think we should like maybe pick our top three right. and then let the fans decide. Like, yeah. yeah. Yeah, we yeah, could do cool. that too. And maybe the winner can come on the show. Whoa, Rick. Right push, now you're, you're pushing getting, it. You're yeah, getting yeah. crazy. <laughs> 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 I'm trying to bring strangers in my house. Right? <laughs> 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 they can was, Skype them in. <laughs> yeah. There we go. Get, <laughs> now you're, yes. I like now that. Now you're being realistic. Now, <laughs> right. So we just got so many emails and we're just kind of blown away by the people wanting to help. So we were like, dude, let's just open this up. Let's put a link, you know, you can go down to the, um, the footer of our website under um, GIFs and graphics there's a link there because the gifts we opened up our own giphy page so with uh with the help of uh our friend uh fred fred Mm venshi he helped us put together a giphy page where you our fans also can upload on our website you know these stickers and gifts of us and we'll oh pick, we'll, 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 yeah, and we'll, we'll pick them. We'll pick which ones we want and just keep this, keep, you know, supplying our Giphy page and just cool. go crazy with it, you know? Because oh, yeah. people make fun shit all the time, yeah. you know? I mean, you know, uh, Maddie Mitchell, he opened yep. the floodgates with that, made one for all of us. Yep. And then exactly. you know, people want to contribute. We, we got a lot of fans that are very talented, multi talented. Hit the button. Shout out to people that are multi-talented. Boom. Got maybe his graphics, other, too. Got his graphics? Yeah. Maybe there's someone out there who can make, like, toys or you know, little dolls or something, you know? Like, no. no yeah. We would, yeah. Love that. There was a Jackass fan that did that. Every cast member. He made, like, these to- little do- uh, toy. I don't know. It was weird, but it was cool. You know, <laughs> <laughs> it was like a voodoo doll? This guy made, I remember going to the Evil Knievel premiere in Manhattan at the Tribeca, and he showed up with this six-foot-tall replica of Johnny Knoxville. Oh, wow. <laughs> it was weird. <laughs> <laughs> That's insane. But it's cool that, you know, he, he was that into it, and he's a very talented guy, you yeah. know? Yeah, yeah. So I mean, sure it's just rad that people do shit like Absolutely. that. Absolutely. You know? Mm-hmm. And people make stuff all the time, so we just thought it would be cool to do, A, graphics for, you know, shirts and mugs, and also gifts. Gifts yeah. and um, stickers for Instagram. You know, stickers are uh, Instagram DMs, tweets, Facebooks. Uh, no, stickers are Instagram stories mm-hmm. and Snapchats. Gifts are, it's a whole thing. You know, if you don't know what it is, then you don't know the what kids it know. is. Yeah, kids know. <laughs> <laughs> they know. Facebook comments, iMessages. I you know what iMessages, Raj? You ever throw out a gift to somebody? Oh my, like through my text? Yeah. No, I've never really actually used that. You never thrown out a GIF? No. Oh, dude, I can have a so full fun. conversation. I, I get them from you all the time. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm always throwing GIFs in a group chat. Yeah. It it really like makes people happy. Yeah, it like, enhances the conversation. Dude, I have I, I have a friend that like we're friends. Like we're business more business than friends. But like we were going through this little rough kind of you know we weren't vibing. Fucking threw out a couple of gifts, fucking little baby going like, la la la, whatever. And he was just. It was all good? Well, poor fucking. It, it was amazing. Best friends again? L- loved it. Like, wow. <laughs> the power of gift. Did you make him toast? No, I did not. Oh. Yeah. Broiled toast? Broiled toast. <laughs> I burnt my pizza the other day in that motherfucker. Dude, that shit. Is... He pulled a Raj. Yeah. <laughs> just like walk away? Like for. And I like, because I think I just left it. To, like I left it, you know, going for a while before I put the pizza in. So when I put the pizza in, that shit was fucking Hot. at its, you know, prime. I went to fucking piss. I come back, the fucking fire alarm's going off. Like fuck it, everything's it's crazy. How long was that? Was it an ogre piss from Love Rangers of the Earth? It was, was it? not that long of a oh, piss, yeah. dude. <laughs> shit was fucking burnt my shit. I, anyway, I just thought, you know, we we just thought it was a cool idea to open up the gates yeah. and have people submit. It's awesome. Artwork smart. and gifts yeah. and, and stickers and all this stuff. So if you go on and our website, it's hard for us to see what, if, if someone put it on Instagram. Yeah, chances of actually seeing it sometimes are yeah. pretty rare. Yeah, exactly. 
And plus two, I, th- I mean, listen, Sam Pearson just sent us this, uh, the burning mug yeah. graphic. We put that on a mug. Maddie yeah. Mitchell, the, the, uh, all of us in bathtubs the and shit. Tub, yeah. We put that on mugs. I mean, anything we just think is cool, you know, we obviously talked to them first, yeah. but, uh, so yeah. So if you want to submit stuff and possibly get it on a shirt or a mug for us, nine club be amazing. Amazing. So go to our website, thenineclub.com. If you scroll all the way down to the footer, it's uh, the links down there. It's like giphys and graphics. Okay. And there's a whole upload link and all that shit. Nice. Figured that out this weekend, Raj. Proud of you. Thank you, bro. See what happens when you guys take a break? I know. You get, all, you get so innovative. You get shit done. <laughs> Put an upload link on our fucking website, you know. Raj got drunk, but you know. standard. <laughs> Where do you think these great ideas come from? <laughs> you gotta relax a little bit. Yeah, oh, the belly of the beast. <laughs> well, we had a great time, Raj. Mm-hmm. We went down to the Clash at Claremont. Good old Andy Mac yep. invited us down there. Really fun. That was fun. The traffic down was not fun. It took us four hours. Ooh, mm. four and a half. Why don't you just take the train? I, we, halfway halfway down, Rick, I said, well, we should have just taken the train. And Roger's like, yeah, the coasters are great. <laughs> yeah, right? It's quick, coaster. easy, you can relax. <laughs> Where do you go? Like, do you go downtown to get out? Yeah, you go to downtown LA, catch right there, straight down, and you're there in two hours. Well, the thing was, Rick, there's two Claremonts, obvi- uh, I guess. You know, <laughs> Didn't know that. But uh, I thought it was a Claremont right over here. Mm-hmm. I don't know where East of LA. East of LA. Yeah. Oh yeah, it's like IE almost. There's like yeah. A, yeah. Yeah. There's there's a manual pad out there. Claremont. I've been there, you know? <laughs> Famous school. Yeah. I get to I come pick up Raj and I'm I'm like, "Oh, what's the address? I'll put in the GPS." And he tells me the address and it's like 5 hours. Oh. And I'm like, "What?" It's a San Diego. Oh. I totally it fucked my mind up. <laughs> to say the least. Sounds stressful. But so there was a minute of debating. Raj, whether we should go or whether we should not go. We did it. But we did. <laughs> Good we job. We headed down there, man. It was rad because you know what? I mean, this whole thing, it's this big thing. They, it benefits the YM, uh, Mission Valley YMCA, the uh, Grind for Life for helping people with cancer. I mean, there's so many good causes involved with this, you know. So we just went down there and, I mean, there were some legends. Who'd you legends. See? You yeah. want to see who we saw? Yeah, let's see it. Okay. We'll show you. I'll show you right now. How you guys doing? Yeah, great. How are you? I sent a sponsor me video back in 89, 90. Did you guys get it? Uh, you know what? Let me go check this file. You che- I think you were pushing Mongo. Please check. I never pushed Mongo. Oh, Let on. me tell you. I don't know. I just wanted to make sure you got it. Uh, if you find it, my number's still the same on the tape. Okay. It's still the same. And what are you guys waiting in line for? Autographs. For who's who? Who's autographs? Um, skaters. I got a sharpie. I'm I'm here. Damn. Oh. Have you seen Sean Sheffy? Not today. Okay. But, but in life, yeah. You let me know if you see him. Okay. Yeah. I will. I'll, I'll I'll run and find you. Please do. All right. Hey, have you seen Sean Sheffy? Nah. You know who he is? Nah. Okay. Well, I know he's a skateboarder. Oh, you know he's a skate. Okay. Yeah. Let me know if you see them, all right? Okay. Is this where the boosted time trials are? Hey, what's going on? I want to I want to get a time trial. Let's do it. Where's the nightclub tech deck? I got them. Where's the You don't have them? I got them. Where are they? I don't have them here, but I got them. There is have you seen Sean Sheffy? Yes, I've seen Sean Sheffy, the legend. Okay, I'm looking for him. He's around. Walk Let me know if you see him. I think he might be at the autograph signing. He's going signing. I'm going to go look. I always see the Nine Club, baby. That's how we do it around here. I'm in. Come on. Yeah, Chris. So, um, lately... You've been talking to a lot of people, and uh, have you ever had any thoughts on who might be some of your favorite guests on the show? Uh, I know you're talking to Steve right now, but uh, I'm interviewing you right now. 
and uh, I like our newer, the, the newer up and coming generation. Dang, <laughs> Cap, did you hear that? Do you have anything to say? He said newer generation. Uh, you can't ollie on a bike. Oh. Well, you heard it straight from Caballero, but uh, I, I have to say, Moto Shibata, new generation. How much do you think I can get the, on eBay for this? You know what? I'd buy that. I don't know. Let's put it on and see, get Hawks on see who's up. Take a hawk? He said, he said, put Hawks on there. And we will see it go up. <laughs> At least it. 10 bucks. Right? <laughs> no, 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 no. We're talking way up, bro. <laughs> Have you seen Sean Sheffy around? No. Okay. Have you seen Sean Sheffy? Not yet. Okay. You know who he is? No. Andy. Hey guys? Listen, bro, you missed me. I did a boosted demo over there. Oh, yeah, you were doing like. I killed it. I'm thinking like once they I get once it. they figure out how to put like rails on on the um, battery, it's gonna be the electric slide. When we first got our boosted boards, we said nobody could flip this thing. <laughs> you did. It took me about an hour to do a 360 flip, but uh, I got. How it was done. your ankle? It was rough. It was my whole leg was sore. Like my hip flexor was sore the next day. Here, how much do you think I can get on that on eBay? Steve Caballero and and um, Christian Asoy. Ooh, dude! That's it's on a chocolate guy. shirt. It's on a chocolate shirt. Yeah. Um, I'm I'm claiming you could get like 250 bucks for Go that. To, yeah. No way. I thought 20 bucks at least. I don't know. 250. You gotta start high at least. I'm gonna start the bidding at 250. Yeah, might as well. Yeah. Have you seen Sean Sheffy? Um, no. Do you know who he is? Um, no. He's a legend. Yeah. He's a legend. We're gonna get going to Wow, you guys are like sneaking up. <laughs> What's up, dude? That's a hell of a ramp to get up. What is that, three feet? Yeah, yeah, three and a half, I think. Wow. Yeah, dude. Did you get me uh, um, a reusable water bottle with a rolling foam aspect? That thing was pretty sick. You know what? We need some, um, we need a, a, a straw, you know those like camelbacks? Yeah. With the black plague feeding okay. you liquor while you're foam rolling. You gotta think outside the box with these things. You All know, right. people want to get drunk and work out. I think that's a new fad for 2019, just to 2020. Keep, just to keep you normal. You, it's gotta, like, you gotta stay on the even keel. Yeah. Have you seen Sean Sheffy? Oh, I know your voice. How do you know my voice? Because well, my husband and I listen to you guys all the time. Okay. He'll like drive me to work, and that'll be like the nine club date. So awesome. I'm the third wheel on the date. <laughs> you are. You are. Have you seen Sean Sheffy? Right there, brother. Come here. Right there, black hat. Oh, I see him. There you go, brother. Thank you, bro. <laughs> Mike V doing his thing. What's going on, bro? I've been looking for you all day. What's going on? It's like a fun time. Note to self, don't do an interview right at the base of a black flag show. Yeah. <laughs> you can't hear a goddamn thing. The whole time I wanted to talk to Sheffy. And that's what you got. That's what I got. <laughs> right at the bottom of the stage. <laughs> you know. He was great. Sean Sheffy. Legend. Yeah, crazy. Yeah. Legend. Is there a certain um, like video part that really resonates with you that he was in? Uh, I mean, the plan B, the life. Life video. Life. Mm -hmm. With the... Um, the Ollie 360. Yeah. Is that anything? It's a whistle though, right? I can't I whistle. Know what you mean. I don't like to whistle. <laughs> doon, 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 doon. <laughs> but I did put this shirt on eBay. Uh, it's about two. It's uh, I put it in there for two fifty. <laughs> uh, Steve Hopalero. Christian Soy and Steve Hopalero autographs on a chocolate shirt. Very used. 
Yeah. <laughs> Start the bidding at two fifty. <laughs> See that? There's even uh, there's a whole, whole bunch of photos here. Any you bids know? yet? Close ups. Wow. There's a, you know, people need to see that they actually were signing them. Oh, this know? price is going to go up. And then I got, uh, you know, Andy Max or being the, uh, the package. The pa- He's the one who said 250, but no bids yet. I'm expecting it to go sk- skyrocketing after this, you know, when did it go live? Just an Today? hour, just an hour ago. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> the old ass chocolate shirt. It's an old ass. <laughs> <laughs> Very used. <laughs> Very used. Well, the description is Christian Asoy and Steve Caballero signed chocolate shirt. Condition is used and may have a slight body odor attached. <laughs> Why didn't you Shipped. get Sean Sheffy's signature? Do you, have you seen the, the type of money that they demand on eBay? No. It's insane, Rick. Well, I hope you get your 250 bucks and then some. Oh, that's just the starting you, bid. It's, it's oh, going so up. Oh, higher. Oh, it's yeah. going up. Okay. But I will say you are very reasonable with your shipping. Shipping's only six ninety five. That's, that's not right. bad. Expedited. Yeah. Well, six, I mean... <laughs> Yeah, I was gonna. I'm well. I'm gonna use the Nine Club account to ship it out. So you know, excited <laughs> shipping. Can we just can we just take a moment to acknowledge the the seller name as well? Our Dueling, Mister Dueling. Our Dueling. Where do you see that? Where oh, yeah, do Mr. you see Dueling. that? Literally right where it said seller. My old eBay account. Yeah, I used to sell a bunch of shit on there. <laughs> Amazing. Here this we is go. great. Christian Asoy and Steve Hopalero autographs. <laughs> Boom. On a very used chocolate shirt. We'll see. Andy Max said I can get 250 So, well, good luck. Thank you. Yes. I appreciate that. Five days left. Six days left. Mm-hmm. Mm. By the time this comes around, it'll be four days. You can get over a grand. <laughs> <laughs> really? Wow. That's sh- I have the shirt right here, by the way. Oh, so we know it's real. It's a real bid. It's real. This is, this is authentic. Who's that? Yeah, it definitely smells. Definitely like has a slight odor. odor. There's a smell definitely coming. Definitely has a slight odor. Oh, God. <laughs> Thank God we have a candle. Steve Hopalero. Steve Hopalero. Can't do an ollie on a bike. That's <laughs> amazing. How amazing. <laughs> the, the fact that he's just running with it Seriously. is incredible. Great, great dudes. Great dudes. That's it. a fucking epic autograph signing. Yeah, Holy right? shit. It was like... You didn't even see the half of it. Yeah. There was like 25 people there signing autographs. Just that little section was yeah. fucking yeah. gnarly. Insane. I just love how Christian was ready to run with your oh mind. Oh my yeah. God. <laughs> True <laughs> Christian fashion. Yes. Too. Like, you're going to get way more than that. Yeah. Come on now. I got stories to tell. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> so He good. wants the spotlight. Anyway, go check out my eBay account. That's the first thing that's up there. More to come. More to come. <laughs> How you doing, Raj? I feel like we need to like do more of that. Like have you sell more shit on eBay. <laughs> sell shit on eBay? It yeah, could be like, like a... autograph stuff, whatever, and you put on eBay. Hmm. <laughs> I'm gonna get i I'll have Rick autograph that shit book and put that on eBay. Hey, there's very limited, so you might get a lot of money for it. I thought that was for a nine club. <laughs> yeah. What the fuck? <laughs> no holds a bar. Yeah, no, I, I, your, your eBay account is out there and it's just fair game. Now, now that <laughs> now that it's going, oh shit. We're not going to have anything left. Yeah, we're going to be sitting here in a blank room. Yeah. Just Where'd like the it? table go? <laughs> I don't know. Some dude in Wisconsin has it now. I mean, that is a nice table right there. It's a beautiful yeah. table. Yeah. That guy's at Focus made it for us, man. Beautiful yeah. people. Should we sell everything in the room? I mean, bro, that eBay is going to my PayPal account. So yeah, I'm down. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, let's get on with it, dude. We got some topics, dude. Sure. Right. We what do. do you want to talk about first, Raj? Pocket or Lottie's Skate Shop? Lottie's. Lottie. Great, great video, man. That was like a fucking real video. Yeah. Like That's that right. wasn't a fucking like just skate shop video. That yeah. was like the the beginning. I was like, dude, imagine. Did they have a premiere in like a... I'm not sure if they had a premiere, but... I don't know. I could just... The it fact felt that, like... The fact that a skate shop was able to produce a video this good. A like, shop premiere? Yeah. Yeah. It a felt, barbecue? Yeah. What do you got going on over there? Oh, I'm going to get a pen. You just throw it over. You just throw it, bro. It's okay. It's Look at that. <laughs> From my ba- baseball years. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I, was, I, was, I played a third base. You know, got to have a strong arm. Throw it all the way across the first. I think we just found our first gift. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we let the people decide. We let the people decide. Trust me, we're going to get some fucking shit. Oh, I believe oh, it. Man. Yeah. Um... Sorry, did I just stop the show? What were you saying? Yeah, you're the, bummed sorry. me out, dude. We were at a full blown. Sorry, we're talking about this uh, this video. 
<laughs> so glad Rick's here, dude. Keeping us on track. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> you, you? I, I think it's racist yeah. to escape shop you, and pull you? up a video like this. How long has he been in a business, Raj? Do you know? A couple years at couple least. Years, yeah. yeah. If you're ever in LA, go visit Lottie's skate shop. Sad thing is, I've never been there. Where Raj. is it? Yeah. It's in uh, near Adams. By Adams Bump, yeah. Adams Bump. Mm -hmm. And that's where. Yeah, I don't, know <laughs> I don't know, but you know what? We'll, <laughs> then, since you brought that to our attention, Jesus, we will put the link in the description. It seems like go. they have a pretty okay. big address. Yeah, they have a pretty big team. It seems like they got a lot of good skaters on it. Yeah, a yeah, lot of people man. back him. Gnarly. Yeah. He's friends with Alex Olson. I used to skate with him mm. and Alex back in the day. Cool kid, cool kid from Santa Monica. Mm. Rad, rad dude. You know, he's just doing rad shit. You know, and it's rad to see everybody supporting him, like Reynolds and Spanky so and Jerry yeah. Sue and mm -hmm. all these people. It's amazing. I got to make it out to check out the shop. That was pretty sick. Reynolds had some uh, footage and bands in his video. I know. Dude, I checked his Instagram. He's like full blown. Just full blown. No skater. announcement yeah. yet. No, though. I was just about to say that. Yeah. But he has been, I saw the comments and he like, he's a G. He like responds to every comment. Mm -hmm. And like someone was like, did Cater like get you riding vans and he just put yes with the exclamation point wow <laughs> like damn all right cool it's cool to see him i don't want to say looking up to cater but you can tell there's like oh, yeah. an appreciation there for sure from the boss that's pretty how sick. many years was he was he with soul tech 20 20 yeah. yeah something like that wow yeah probably right raj showed me his instagram feed the other day and it was literally Reynolds shoe, Reynolds shoe, Reynolds shoe, Reynolds shoe, Reynolds shoe. Yeah. Just Reynolds shoe. What, who? Yeah. Yeah. Everybody just just posting all people his people were just posting like his old shoes uh, and like, like stuff. And it was just like it was almost like he passed away in a weird way. Like it was just all Reynolds, 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 Reynolds. Like, America oh, shoe, dude, America shoe. Yeah. I fucking ate sushi at this place the other day, and this girl was there, and she like kind of follows skateboarding, and she's like, "Oh my god, I heard uh, Reynolds retired." <laughs> was like, nah, he just left America and like he's doing some shit. But yeah, fuck, crazy. It's an end of an era. It's, it's, yeah. it's kind of sad. Yeah, it is different for sure. Yeah. yeah. But also the start of something new. Mm. Yeah. Start, of, start of a new chapter. Yeah. yeah. You know? One door closes and another one is opening. Dude, and he did. He was wearing the half cabs in a clip I seen. Did I got yeah. tagged so much on that? Dude. <laughs> yeah. I was like, that looks good. Team team cab. Dude, and Spanky was wearing Vans too. Did you see that shit? Was he? Yeah. Am I am I tripping? No, sorry, sorry. Herman. Oh. Herman was wearing Vans. Oh. Okay. No. Oh. They were skating and I saw a clip. Oh, Vans are good shoes. Great shoes. Yeah, yeah I agree. Excellent shoes. Size 13 over here. Ooh, <laughs> size 14 player, big boy club. Wow, look at Finally that. Finally got somebody next to me who can compare. Nine and a half, big dog. <laughs> 10. 15. I'm going to do a 10 too. What? 12, 13, depending Jesus. on the cut of the shoe. Okay, you don't believe me? 15 and a half. Hey, Sorry. I see you with the uh, New Balance 574s on today. You switched up your kit a little bit. Yeah, Chad Tim Tim sent me some I, shoes. I don't think I don't <laughs> recognize the player. I got the old man kit. That's I not it. It's not those... You're making them look good. They, thank you, bro. I got well, you. Well, the bro. thing is, is you know, I, I walk over here from my place. I go and take walks and stuff, and I'm wear <laughs> all these <laughs> shoes. I go feed the ducks in the canal. I do. <laughs> I don't actually, uh, but I all these skate shoes hurt my feet. Yeah. I would walk over here, pick up a hard drive, and I'd walk home halfway home. My foot would already be hurting. Yeah. You know, I'm like, have good shoes. Mm -hmm. and, so, and as you get older too, like you gotta. Got to keep your feet gotta right. Got to take care of the tootsies. Yeah, yeah you got to have tootsies, those walkers, man. as yeah. I call them. Yeah. Yeah. So Tim Tim sent me the walkers. Nice. Mm. What are they? New Balance 574. Yeah, they look good. 574s. Mm -hmm. White and uh, size 13 over here. White green. <laughs> <laughs> Just saying. <laughs> I like his style. He's on the, he's on the experience for the first time, and he's already just like, let me go ahead and plug myself Bring it on. Bring it on. But back to Lottie's video, uh, Lottie Skate Shop must be stopped. It's great. Uh, some rad shit. Uh, Nick Nick Michael? Is that his name? Mm -hmm. Nick Michael? Which had one? A yeah, dude. LA this High Line? That you've never seen been skated like yeah, that before? exactly. I was tripping, dude. That was so sick. That was amazing. So good. Yeah. Wow. Because that's on the other side of the rail, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Like the rail's right there. To the, yeah, but okay. no one's ever skated. That was so sick to yeah. see that. Yeah. 
He's getting creative. Yeah, man. I, I like, like it. that. Yeah. Nice the thing. other angle. Do you have the other angle? No. Nah. No. This oh, guy's oh, yeah. a thinker. He's like, this place has been skated like crazy. I'm going to try something different. Yeah, yeah. man. Yeah. Love it's thinkers. Cool. It's Love kind of scary thinkers. to wally over onto those benches because the benches are like wood. Wobbly. Right. Wobbly like wood. Sketchy. Yeah. Yeah. Your wheel gets caught in the wrong. Yeah, exactly. I right. like the uh, around the tree spot they skated. That looks oh, so fun. How fun is that, dude? Yeah. yeah. No, well, it, you ollie. Well, they were ollieing from the street. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think um, somebody else skated that. I don't know. Dude, that fucking, I don't know if it was Nolly or Fakey, the half cab crook. Is it pop, pop, pop into the bush. sidewalk? Dude. Yeah. yeah. So good. Thinkers. I think I just like it. he's doing rad shit over there with his shop. Mm -hmm. The little ending where they all came out and bowed. How and fucking beautiful was that, dude? <laughs> Made so me happy. Good. Yeah. What are we doing? We're missing something here. What are bro. we doing? What are we missing? <laughs> yeah, what's going on? <laughs> Someone's having a good time in Brazil. <laughs> I wonder if people are coming up to him like, dude, just can you laugh for me, dudes? <laughs> I bet he, I, he's getting that. Evan from Houston, Texas. I can answer your question in two seconds. Yeah, so I was wondering, nose grinds. Uh, do you think that it's possible to do nose grind on a round rail, specifically a, a round handrail? Because, you know, when you do nose grind, you're supposed to be balanced. Your wood's not supposed to be touching, but you can't really do that on a round rail. I don't know. You seen, yes, you can. I, I seen Shane do a balanced 5 0 on a round mm -hmm. bar. In the middle of his truck. Not touching yeah. nothing. Wouldn't be surprised if somebody. Well, I've never did. seen one in a nose grind. It's possible. Yeah, anything is possible for sure. But what do you call it? Do you do right, you well, call Chris, it? I'm gonna need to see one of those from you. <laughs> Not on a round bar, but go check my old footage, dude. Uh, balanced for sure. No, no, no scraping. Yeah, for sure. No yeah. scraping. Oh, I, I love it. It's illegal, in my book. Yeah. In Wex book. Yeah, I mean, just whatever, bro. You know. I will scrape a nose wheelie though. You're pretty good. At yeah. Snowplow. Did one across the whole courthouse ledge. Touched the nose the whole way. <laughs> Oh, I seen that. That's pretty funny. All right. Well, y'all, if you see one of those balanced nose grinds on a, a round bar, let me know. All right, we'll tag you. Um, send it to the the balanced nose grinds Instagram account. Oh, Jesus. oh, you got a balanced nose grind Instagram <laughs> account? Okay. So you you yeah, really are on the lookout out. for one. <laughs> I am. <laughs> Colt Cannon did one on, on a Colt Cannon did one on a handrail, but it was a square rail. Oh, yeah. That's a really good one. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, if that. Kelly was here, I bet he'd have an answer for this. He might probably. have an answer for that one. He probably <laughs> saw one this weekend in Street League. You never know. Yeah. Well, Evan, we'll 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 let you know. And if you see one, tag us too. The Nine Club. All right, I will. All right, G. All right, have a good one, guys. Later, thanks. Later, later, later yeah, bud. Thanks. That's what I'm saying. That's our balance knows. There's an Instagram account for everything. Yes. Yeah. Das pinch. Now we got the balance, balance to nose grind. <laughs> a lot of mercy. <laughs> you know this uh, pocket, yes. pocket mag on uh, YouTube. The book over here. Yeah. Oh, they have a YouTube channel too. They do some rad shit. This northbound video is fucking. I loved it. Maybe gas for gas. I, Griffin Gas <laughs> is the truth. He is the, the truth. truth. Man. Wow. Versace that. too. It was so weird seeing his real name. I was like, wait, who yeah, is this like, guy? Yeah. <laughs> you can count her? That's where, a nice shot. where was this? Like, where are these dudes from? Are they, is it Seattle? A lot of these guys were from like Germany, okay. but this is all like um, Portland, like Seattle area. Pacific Northwest. Yeah. Okay. Now, Rick, I just heard you say that's a nice shot. You know, yeah. would you, is there anything different you would do in that situation? You know, I see the shadow of him on the wall and the... Uh, I like this. It could be naturally lit. I can't really tell. Mm. But it, I mean, you'd have to have a really tall like C-stand with this with oh, the flash the mounted. So I said it looks like it's naturally lit. Okay. It looks good. Long lens? You're, you're feeling long? Lens? Absolutely. Okay. Yeah, that's pretty gnarly. Yeah. That's oh. Nice perspective to the photo. Mm. I was going to ask, was, was it a big brother that was photoshopped with the wheel? Oh, yeah. Lights? We did a lot of that stuff. Was that? <laughs> I forgot to ask you while you were here. It was the Chris Markovich yeah. cover. Yeah, and there's a oh, wheel yeah. in the bush. Oh, man. What Jeff, happened? Jeff Tremaine was so embarrassed. What? Why were you moving him? Because I think just so it would probably with the logo. Okay. And so it made it like just fit perfectly. Oh. But you raise him up higher, right? I don't even remember. Was it higher or lower? I haven't seen that cover in a long, in a long time. Do you so, got one? 
doubt. Somebody, yeah. they, they had, there was a, a Big Brother cover with Chris, Mar- Chris Markovich on a mini ramp or something, right? Yeah. He was doing a frontside air or something. And, and there was a wheel just mysteriously in the bushes, <laughs> like they had oh missed God. it from photoshopping. Amazing. And not to bring this one other, uh, my Keith Huffnagel cover was photoshopped. They had to fix something and it was messed up. It was so embarrassing. What, which cover, what was he doing on there? What, what, I think a 50 50 down a rail, 50, 50, somewhere in Los Angeles. Oh. Huh. And it's like his first Big Brother cover, and we ruined it. <laughs> what, what did he? Why was it Photoshop bad? What would happen? I don't remember the whole like process, but I just know he fucked it up. <laughs> God, losers. <laughs> but is nobody like double, triple checking these things, or they just get well, you, done so fast? You, I think it might have been the last minute. I wasn't probably there at the at the crunch, you know. Mm. But yeah, it's it sucks because you go out, you do this work, and you're like trying to do a good job, and. Someone drops the ball at the, at the last second of the game. Decided to take a little break at the two yard line. <laughs> Fuck! Someone drops the, <laughs> drops the wheel in the bush. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Sorry, amazing. Huff. Sorry, Markovich. Uh, <laughs> it's funny because I really wanted to ask you that when you were here, and totally spaced it. You know. Save that question for the day you have Jeff Tremaine as a guest. Oh, Ooh. okay. We can come back to it. Yeah, yeah I'll put that in the, in yeah. the notes here. We'll save. Save that question for, and I'll make him as a, I'll make like that happen for you guys. He'll come on. He'll be great. Yeah, he'll be fucking awesome. Parentheses wheel. You're still writing this now. In, it's taking notes. It's important. Hey. The bush. Production notes. You see the way he snatched that right pen here. out the air. He's got to use that now. Marco, <laughs> I'm probably just gonna throw these away anyway after the show. <laughs> Uh, anyway, back to the uh, the pocket video, the um, Griffin gas. Can we just check out this manual oh, trick real quick? Yes. It was insane. Jesus. Mm. He's like power and finesse like together. Combined, yeah. yeah. Was that switch? Yeah. Mm-hmm. To null- and I didn't to, even think he was going to pull something out at the end. Yeah. I really didn't. To like Nolly flipped out. Curve it and find the in between the skate stoppers and then Nolly flips. Like. How was that other line he did with the fucking Nolly back nose blunt? Sh- fucking big spin or some shove it in front of him or some shit? Oh, yeah. Mm. Fucking Oh, yeah. The, the weird way? Yeah. yeah. Wow. Dude, you yes. know what I loved about this video? The music. <laughs> Yeah, it was really mm-hmm. good. The first song, then the second, the second song, song was, was hard. hard. But to like go with the first, like the yeah. first song was just so ill, and then it was so different. Yep. The second one, like, it was dope. We were just talking about Versace. Just did the uh, big flip over the, the little street gap thing. Yeah. Wow, it was proper. This guy's good at skateboarding. Well, what happened? It's that's part of the video. Clip, yeah. Oh, it's part of the video. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Well, that's one of the... I don't remember the glitching. A little zero line. Stoked, homie. Stoked so for him. Good. Is this I, Pacific go, Northwest? Yeah, yeah. That's a big street gap. That's a yeah, very yeah. big street gap. That's rough too. Yeah, mm-hmm. weathered. Oh yeah, <laughs> weathered street. Kid's yeah. good. Yeah, kid is good. Kind of got that Chris Roberts arm right there. Said, yeah, what is happening with? That? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. And also, we got a. Uh, I don't know how to say Farid Ulrich. Farid Ulrich. The hard flip on board. Oh, what yes. the fuck was that? That was a great trick. Look at that. Yeah, that I remember filming there on King of the Road, and that landing right there is brutal. If you fall, you're done. It's just like, like cheese grater. It's just cheese grater. Yeah. It's so rough. Damn. These guys, man. It's a hard trick, man. It's, I can't yeah. even hard flip on flat. Same. <laughs> Eric, you ever done a hard flip? No, I haven't. <laughs> <laughs> I need to get this board. Uh, need a bigger version of it. I need like three of them, Raj. I need get one for sound bites. I need one for the whole thing. Let's get an iPad. One of the big ones. Mm-hmm. The iPad Pro. iPad Pro. Yeah. Twelve. Twelve point nine or whatever the fuck nine. it is. Yeah. It's big. Yeah. Hey, it gives you all your your quadrants that you need. <laughs> oh man, I see this better. Mm. Mm. Just need someone in the corner over there just doing that True. on their own. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> we need somebody good though. Yeah. Hey, yeah. Can't have somebody just fucking. Oh yeah, 1, I'm gonna show all. Oh yeah, one thousand. Shout out to comments. people that are multi talented That's a party in itself. <laughs> it sounds like a like that, yeah. cool party right there. Shout out to multi talented I'm a skater. <laughs> yeah, that's a sick one. Dude. I think my computer just blew up. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> <laughs> just, just just mid show well. Wow. Definitely oh, different. Than oh, well. Oh. oh well. 
we got a, uh, you know, primitive adding people to the roster. Huh? I knew it. I, didn't we talk about it the other the, the other week, Rush? On uh, one week. Off that one would week. be that would be last mm-hmm. week. Yeah. Last week. Yeah, that would be last week. Last week. Miles Silvis. Mm-hmm. Where did he go? Went, went to primitive. Jeez. Look at that. Huh? Go figure. <laughs> Dude, it was so crazy. I like was like looking at something, and it was like they just Spencer Hamilton. Yeah. Like mm-hmm. that was like. Yeah. Uh, not um, even a month ago. Mm-hmm. Well, I told you everybody in the industry is going to skate for primitive. Yeah. The crazy thing is Spencer Hamilton's been on for a while and they just put his board out. Mm. Yeah. So that was the weird part too. Oh, interesting. Yeah, he was huh. on for a couple months before they actually put a, a board out. Which, oh. we're I all. We're, I talked to P. Rod. We're all getting on primitive. <laughs> yeah, you too, Rick. Sweet. <laughs> <laughs> Limited edition. A hundred boards special. Yeah, I'll do it. <laughs> <laughs> It'll just be him, like in gold. Yeah, <laughs> like all oh, like a Buddha. Like we man on the cover, but but in gold. <laughs> yeah. That's a great idea. Let's do it. <laughs> well deserved, though. Miles of fits course. right in with those dudes. You this know. trick, too. Dude, little com- oh, I like this photo. Like. Yeah, his little commercial was amazing. Mm-hmm. I love Rick's commenting on every photo. Well, <laughs> I like how it's backlit, but yet you get mm-hmm. the flash filling in, which is really smart. Mm-hmm. Mm, okay. Oliver Makes it more of a, a little more cinematic feel to it. It's funny. I never really look that deep into photos. I, I usually do. just see them and I go, oh, cool. You know, look at the trick or something. Mm, I always like it. I'm looking at the lighting. Is there any pho- uh, photographers that you like right now? Or do you even keep up with the new dudes? Also known as photographers. photographers yes. Whoa. <laughs> Would be a word as What well. did I say? Photographers? <laughs> well, it's, photographers. Ha- it's hard to, to follow anyone because there's really no magazines except for one. True. So, I mean, the, I feel like it's just the the art has just been displaced to Instagram. and it's Now, do you feel like this? it's going to come back? Do you think it has like... A magazine? It, yeah. Well, if vinyl came back, that's why what not? I'm saying. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And vinyl is huge right now. That's true. There's a lot of manufacturing plants. I want a magazine, and I I think the, it's important to have a magazine because you want to sit down and look at the pages, and I don't want to look at my phone for hours. It sucks. Right. We're on it enough. Right. Yep. I agree. A lot of people do though. A lot that's, of people. I mean, like to your point, that's the only way, only place we really have to go to see these things yeah. at this mm-hmm. moment in time. Yeah, it's true. It's sad, but true. Anything else about Miles Silvis? I'm stoked for him. <laughs> stoked for Miles Silvis. You know, it's a great dude. I want to know where he gets his fucking jeans. They look like they fit like really nice. It's a good fitting jean. I have trouble with jeans. You should DM him. I, I was thinking about it. It looks like a nice Levi's like. Like what cut though? Five one seven. I don't know. Listen, it's got to be comfortable. Like, look at that position. (laughs) (laughs) The guy looks good out there. Yeah, it could just be a like an OG five hundred one. Now, what trick is this? He's doing. Is this a heel flip? Nolly heel. 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 Okay, Mm -hmm. but it's like shifty. shifty. Yeah, Yeah, it was. Mm. It was good. Wow, it's kind of like weird positioning on the photo. I mean, it's cool, but you know, you could tell he's like a nolly. But it's like, I want to see the board a little bit more. Turn tweaked more, maybe a little turn a little more for okay. the phone. that's how I would have done oh huh. I feel like with Miles though it's like you, you get, get one shot, one shot. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Seriously. I'm gonna do it first try so I shot ready. a cover of Rodney Mullen and he did some like a nolly flip but the way I got somehow caught the board was just perfect hmm. and it was a blank oh it makes me pissed about this because I'm bringing this up it was a no graphic board and at the time he was trying to put the stop of like the team members oh and we were like fighting, like, no, this is the shot because it was perfect. And he was like, no, I want this one. And I'm, we've, we won. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were going to say we photoshopped in. No, 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 no. That, that was not, no, we just let it, let it run. And yeah, because that graphic would have ended up on the stairs or whatever he yeah. was going over. <laughs> uh, you know what, Raj, our boy, we were talking about him before, you know, good old Alex Olson, mm-hmm. you know, just put out a 917 video. Yeah. And where was his footage at? Oh, Raj wants to see some uh, Alex Olsen foot. Oh, don't we all? So if we call this number right now, what will happen? Call it. Find out. All right. (laughs) Rick is calling the number. 917-692-2706. Put on speakerphone. Definitely. I do like those graphics that they have right now where it's like the number and then the name behind it. Mm -hmm. Looks clean. Why don't we call the day yet? Huh? When I'm recalled to Daddy. Hi, this is Eddie Pomerantz. Leave a message and I'll call you back. Eddie Pomerantz. 
Hmm. Who's that? Who the fuck is that? Record your message. When you finished recording, you may hang up. You guys want to leave him a message? Go ahead. Yeah. 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 Classic. I'm not leaving you a message. I'm hanging up. (laughs) (laughs) I think a lot of the music, I'm not certain, but I think maybe a lot of the music was uh, Alex. Right? Probably. I don't know. I'm just assuming. Yeah. Because he's into that. Music supervisor. Yeah. That's why he didn't have tricks. He was doing the music. Mm. Too busy. Too busy producing the soundtrack. Mm -hmm. Maybe he's working on some Nike thing, bro. We don't know. Who knows? Nike money. (laughs) (laughs) His dad is amazing. (laughs) Steve. But there there was a... uh, um, Max Palmer? Max Palmer. Cyrus Bennett? Cyrus Bennett. Cyrus Bennett, dude. Cyrus. I like that name. Killing it. Are you going straight for like his last trick? <laughs> Why not? It was a doozy. Wow. wow. That was so sketchy at the end. God Amazing. He also board slid it too. Also, too, he's uh this. Up the bank. Yeah. Dude, he looked like Huff right there. Ooh, that's yeah. Cool. yeah that's cool. nice I like that push. Nice push yeah. after. That was a strong Boom. push. Yeah. yeah. That was like, I am going to get coffee right now. Kind of looks like <laughs> you know, uh, Joey Pepper a little bit. Oh, yeah. yeah. You know what that push reminds me of, though? You remember in uh, Wonderful Horrible Life, PJ's last line, where he just He's pushes. Just like, and just, yeah. yeah. That's true. That's true. <laughs> yeah. Ain't nothing like a good push. Straight up. Yeah. Phone in pocket, too. Just notice that. Phone in That's pocket. That's sketchy. Oh, yeah. It's a big phone. Looks like a... I wonder what, what kind of jeans he's wearing. <laughs> yeah, what, what cut is that? <laughs> what socks are those? Those are some nice socks. <laughs> 501? What bearings he's He looks here, definitely right? comfortable. <laughs> <laughs> very, very much so. <laughs> and Cyrus just keeps bringing the heat, man. You know? Dude, wow. A little yeah, manual cool. over the little bumps. I love spots like that. Yeah. yeah. Like we, the primitive tour video we watched last time when the, um, the guy with the red hair, I can't remember his name, went up on the, went on the side of the mm-hmm. bike rack and had to kind of like maneuver mm-hmm. through. So I love when people get creative with shit like that. That's yeah, right. Definitely. Look at that. That's a good spot. Manual pad. What'd you try there? Same thing, but uh, fake you flip out. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. Uh, Max Palmer, though. Raj. Killing the game, also. Mm-hmm. Killing the haircut, it's, too. Uh, this is nuts. Wow. Yeah. A little blunt slide on the thing. Yeah. <sighs> Those wheels. <laughs> oh. That's cool. Two tricks in one. Pretty I much. love that. Also, very comfortable pants. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> They're definitely comfy. Love what Alex is doing over there, man. Nine one seven. What's his other fucking amazing Bianca? company? Yeah, Bianca Shandon. That shit's cool, man. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he's, he's doing rad shit. Talked to his dad the other day, Steve. What do you have what to say? It? He just was rad. Just, he, Steve calls for once in a while, rap out, see what's going on. You know, he's nice. a good dude. It's awesome. We got Ace from Illinois. Yo, yo. What's up, Ace? Yo, how you guys doing in that? I, I like that name, Ace. Rose it's pretty Thomas. good. It's a good name. Thanks, bro. Guess Ace. I got it a good card. Name, you what? I got it from my last name, brother. You got it from your... Ace. Yeah, like Ace Ventura, like the movie, bro. Yeah, yeah. Oh. yeah you yeah. smoking weed Ace tonight, Ace? Ace? Ace <laughs> of course. Justin, of course you are. Justin wishes he was over there with you <laughs> in I Illinois. Mean, shit. Now, dude, yo, man, hey, if I was local, I would have slid through. I would have hooked you up, man. It's all good. All good. Hey, you, uh, no, yo, so. Yeah. So me and my homies, were going to Barcelona in March, and it's like our first trip there. Like, no one's ever been there before. Mm. And, uh. We were just trying to see like what kind of spot should we hit like what's like what's like what do we like what should we expect like literally walk out of your go? hotel room and just look around yeah, yeah. <laughs> just one, roll around you're gonna find it's really just, one thousand it's just like that yeah. doesn't, doesn't mm-hmm. someone have like an Instagram account that's just skate spots oh, I'm sure for sure I'm you know? sure there has to be yeah right but literally Ace. You go hop on a train, you could hop on and off anywhere, and literally you're going to pass by spots while you're going to a spot. Yep. Yep. You're, you're skating, you're like, so why don't we cool. stop and skate that? You're like, well, we're going to something better. It's crazy out there. So, so, no, weird. All right, yeah, no, I was just trying to see what's up, man. Yeah, like, it was kind of just like a randomly planned trip amongst me and my friends, so. How, how long are you, you going for? Shout out to Modelo Boys. Okay. Huh? 
How long are you going for? Uh, just from like March 20th through like the 27th. So just like a week. Mm, not enough time. Yeah. You not probably, enough yeah. time. Extend it's that just, ticket. You probably yeah, extend you it. You might not come I, back. Big dog. Yeah. I was probably going to, I was probably going to bring money to definitely stay a little bit longer. Keep eye out for uh, pickpockets. Yeah. Careful of the, yeah. Yeah. is it that yeah, intense yeah. there? Oh, it's, it's not. kind of gnarly. If yeah. they'll if you're, you know, if you have fun, if you're drinking out there, maybe you're walking back a little tipsy uh, at night alley. on the Rambler or uh-huh. down an alley. Yeah, Fuck all, all that, man. I'm going to be smoking. I'm not going to be doing that. Okay. Yeah. Well, maybe if <laughs> you. I'm not, I'm not getting, I'm not getting caught up. Okay. You're, you're going to get robbed just on the train. You never know. It's. No, so, yeah. I heard, dude, I heard some story about some dude fucking, he was like sitting in the seat on the train. And, like, behind him, like, he had, like, a prosthetic arm and, like, his uh, jacket sleeve. And he was, like, creeping through backpacks, like, behind people and shit. Oh. Like, they got, like, all crafty there and shit. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You know what it is, Ace? If you if you look like you know what's going down, mm-hmm. they won't fuck with you. Yeah. Like, if, you, if you're just spacey and just kind of drawn, just kind of whatever, like, that, that, those are the people that they yeah. target. If yeah. you got your head up... And you can and you see somebody and you look at them like I know what you're doing. You know yeah. it's all good. Go do your thing. I'm doing my thing. Yeah. They'll 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 right. leave you alone. Yeah. Say it with your chest. Exactly. Say it with your chest. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> no, for sure. No, I no, I appreciate it. Yeah, man. Have fun out there, dude. And you, like I said, you just just go. You'll find yeah. plenty right. of shit to skate. Plus, everybody's fucking cool as fuck yeah. down there, dude. Yeah. You just talk to any of the locals, they'll tell you any, any spot you want to know. Do I got to worry about not speaking Spanish? Nope. 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 <laughs> nope. No. Everybody cool. speaks English. You'll be good. You got so, bye. Honestly, bro, just start at yeah. Makba, and then from there, you'll meet people. And the shop was at Rufus. is right there, too. Rufus. Like, just go talk to them. Like, you'll... If you're cool and you just kind of do it the right way, you'll definitely make friends and people will take care of you for sure. Yeah, you go to the main spots, Parallel, Makba, you're chilling. Yeah, we were were already planning on hitting all that. That's why I was like, I didn't know if there was any like, uh, I don't know, just like some random shit out there that's just super fire to skate. I didn't really know like what was popping, you know? Yeah, you'll you'll definitely find your way. All those dudes are super, super cool. cool. Yeah, it'll be, you'll you'll have the time of your life out there. Trust me. Thank you. I appreciate it. All right, Ace. Have a great night. You too, man. Are you dabbing? Are you taking bong hits or smoking? A, what are you doing over there? No, dude. I, I just smoked a joint. Oh, okay. It's Illinois. It's just flour okay. out there. All right. <laughs> uh, my bad. No, yo, dude. They got some, yo, man. They got some, some shitty shit out here. Unless you're <laughs> that, that, no, for real, man. That cart shit is out of here. And oh, that yeah. wax is like, that <laughs> wax shit. I mean, it's all right, bro, but. Nah, it's because you're getting it from fucking Tyrone around the corner. That's why. <laughs> Straight up, dude. It's just a fucking waste of your time. Man. Hell yeah. All right, Jimmy. Right, be, be safe out there, huh? Yeah, hell yeah. I appreciate it, guys, for real. All right, Ace. Hell yeah, G. Later, Later bro. Peace. Peace. There you go, Ace from Illinois. Going out to Barcelona, man. I'm kind of jealous. Yeah, I'd me love too. to go back to Spain. Oh, me too. Spain's the best. Yeah, the other time I was there, we were shooting uh, the 3.5 of Jackass and uh, didn't have enough time. And man, I would just love to go back and hit the museums. Mm. Yeah. It's everything, you, everywhere you look is just so amazing. Yeah. 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 Well, that's what I was saying. The, the, a week out there is like nothing. Nothing. Mm-hmm. Nothing. You're just getting over your jet lag in a week. Right. Yeah. <laughs> You all right, Raj? You got jet lag? I got a little jet lag right now. A little jet lag? (laughs) From your room to out here. (laughs) (laughs) He's still recovering from that trip to, what was it, Carlson? Yeah, uh, Clash the Claremont. Oh, that drive. (laughs) Dude, four and a half hours there. About four? Three and a half hours back. Well, Raj, we missed the freeway. Yeah. This guy's on his Instagram. I'm driving, burnt. And I'm, I'm talking about, the, there were three lanes of the highway, <laughs> right? Three lanes, and it's traffic, and there's this huge, like they had like painted off. He missed a 405 split. Oh. But I'm looking at the thing, I'm like, why the fuck are there three lanes? They have all this room over here, why are they to add more lanes, threes and nine? And then Roger's like, where are we? And I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> And Roger looked on his phone and like, he's like, we're in Downey. We got we to gotta get back home. Oh, my God. God. We're going the wrong way. You know, they have these big things. They're called signs. And they you say know when like, you're like, where to go. I was he toast. Was, we're and he was zoned in on Howard Stern. Let's be real. Yeah. Well, there was True. Something going on there. True. Are you listening to the app? I do. Okay. Yeah. Sirius XM. Yeah. But 
Raj, it didn't take us that long to get back on track. It no. probably added about 25 minutes to our drive. Totally. Yeah. So it wasn't bad. But it was just funny because we were like, I don't know where we are. We're just, <laughs> we're just in Downey. We're in Downey. <laughs> <laughs> After like an eight hour day, yeah. we're fucking lost. Could you imagine without iPhones or GPS or anything, we'd no. have to get on the fucking Thomas Guide and look where we were. But you're from Southern California, aren't you? That doesn't mean I know where shit Come is. Come on, Rick. he's from Dude. this bubble yes. of Southern California. But you're a skateboarder. <laughs> he doesn't you travel. Leave the marina. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. He never. Rick, if you were in Downey, do you you would know how to get back without <laughs> any deep. Yes, 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 yes. No, I used to deliver car parts in Los Angeles, <laughs> so I knew my way around the grid. That's how I learned. There's Damn. fucking okay. signs, dude. Okay. <laughs> signs and just pay attention. Yeah, just, man. Yeah. I dude, imagine though, like like you said, not having iPhone when I first moved out oh here. My God. I, I, the maps weren't what they are now. But had I not had that with all the different freeways and all that shit, like it was rough. I do remember though. I was kind of to your point when I was working at the barracks and I lived in uh, Studio City. I made myself figure out how to get home without using my phone or without getting mm. on the freeway. Okay. And I used the Hollywood sign as my north star. And I just like, go. straight up, I just like follow the streets until I got close enough to it where I knew where I was at. And I was like, okay, I can take this. Oh, you like, mean surface streets? You yeah, because yeah, oh, yeah. I wanted to avoid track because, dude, downtown to Studio City at like five o'clock. I mean, LA is a grid, you know? Yeah, it's a grid. So yeah, it's, it's grid lock. Yeah. yeah, exactly. Gentlemen, we haven't True. had phones for that long. Like, there people get around. Like, yeah. no, I have this argument with my sister. Like, dude, the, the younger generation rely on these fucking phones. phones for to get places. She didn't even know what was west and what was fucking north and what was south. I'm like, you, I cool. If you live in the middle of the fucking country, cool. I can maybe what's get. The, where what's, what's the difference between? Because the, we have the ocean. The West Coast is right here. <laughs> it's right there. That's west. You, at least you have west. The sun rises in the east. <laughs> it sets in the west. Not that hard to figure Pretty out. Fucking easy. Yeah, I mean, I'll give it to Waze if you want to get around traffic. Fuck Waze. Uh, oh, oh yeah, fuck Waze. Wow, Damn. bullshit. <laughs> Talking about say with your chest. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> why? Why? Wait, why do you feel why? It, because it takes you all the wrong ways. Ways. Ways takes you the wrong ways. But there's he's trying to like yeah. get you out of mm. you, Uber, all the Uber drivers rely on it <laughs> and it sends you into the worst possible way uh, direction. You know, I will say it's unsafe. Yeah, I've had some ghetto. you can change the settings, but I, I have had ways take me to these intersections that are impossible it's to cross. Stupid. Yeah. It's stupid. Yeah. Like, it's like you can't like watch. It's yeah. like, why are you taking me to this? There's no light. Tons yeah. of cars, and yeah. it's totally unsafe. Like, I, I could have sat at the light, mm -hmm. made a left, but right. instead you made me go around the light, now I have to make a left on this yeah, it's and, yeah. it, and it's pushing street. cars through small streets where there's kids. It's just dumb. Yeah. I don't know. Uh, I will say this, though. I, I have been less skate skater in my later years, but I will... What? What? what less what? Skater. Skate huh? skater. Okay. Like, skate skater. Got it. Okay. Uh, but I have experience different parts of cities because of that like how they take you fucking just places you've never seen i've found a bunch of skate spots because of that fucking app so just gotta take yeah. a drive and go for it you yeah. know yeah. hey man gas is like 479 gallons. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. i don't know about that's just taking a, a big, drive that's a big plot they're sending you around gas stations <laughs> further away oh man you know raj last week we talked about YouTube pages. We talked about maybe, you know, skaters starting their own YouTube pages. Monetizing their own shit. Monetizing their Smart. own shit and yeah. everything. And then yeah. here we, you know, here's a here's a skater, Johnny Geiger. I think it's really pronounced Geiger. I don't know. Mm. Swiss, I think. Mm -hmm. He's Swiss. Uh, skates for Revive. And he just came out with a part, put it on his own YouTube channel. And I got super interested in how these guys navigate their shit you know no it's interesting what do you mean shit well the traditional way raj is you film a video part for you know a video a mag brand. a brand yeah. or you know a trans world video or you know very rarely does a skater film a video part and put it on his own youtube page i think it's smart you know? this yeah. is what these guys are doing though you know andy schrock these uh the revive guys this is what they do yeah. right they all have their own youtube pages there's not a which I found was really interesting. There wasn't a revive YouTube page. There wasn't a brand mm -hmm. YouTube page. It was Schrock. all individuals. It's What's that? So smart. It's all Andy Schrock. Yeah, I mean, Andy, Andy Schrock is Andy Schrock. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
all these guys just have their own YouTube pages, yeah. which I thought was interesting because they film a video part, they put it on their own YouTube page, they tell everybody in the description, go buy my boards here. Mm -hmm. And so they're sending, all these YouTubers are sending traffic over to yep. the Revive Whatever. shot. And then, and then the YouTube channels are telling people, go look at exactly. this guy's channel, go look at yeah. this, it's all intertwined. Dude, they've, they've kind of broken the you algorithm, web, so to yeah. speak. Yeah, you create your own little uh, web of content. And I think this is like, this is so smart and, and you know, to your point, the, the traditional way doesn't necessarily work for everyone because some of these guys wouldn't have been accepted in the traditional skateboard right, industry. Right. So instead of taking that L, they are like, all right, well, we're just gonna do this on our own. Johnny's got like 320,000 subscribers on yeah. his wow, YouTube Wow, that's a lot. Yeah. And it's like, you know, these, these guys see it and I think it's the younger generation gets it. They don't have this thing in the back of their mind where it's like, this is the only path that I have to take to, yeah. to yeah. make it in this industry. I can just be a disruptor and create my own shit and then we'll have this brand that it's living and it's breathing, but it's all through us yeah. and through yeah. our channels. And not to mention, he he's had his YouTube page for eight years. So it's eight years of work of that course. he's put into it, yeah. you know? Like Andy Schrox has, has 2.8 million subscribers. Oh shit, I didn't know that. Wow. He started his page in 2007, wow. 12 years ago. That's Man. when YouTube started, I believe. So they, they've been putting in... The work. Yeah. The work, you know? But I thought it was, I mean... What's crazy to me is that, you know, it made me start thinking about, well, okay, how did they... You want to start doing boards? No, 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 <laughs> no. Why not? No. <laughs> <laughs> it made me start thinking about, like, they're probably monetizing their own channel, which means they're making money off their own channel. Mm -hmm. I wonder, they're probably maybe just getting board royalties probably from so. Revive, maybe a salary. I don't think so because they're already supporting themselves mm -hmm. they don't really have to rely on a sponsor i thought it was interesting huh? you know yeah. like the way that they're kind of going about it i think it's cool because the company is then like i said kind of i don't want to say riding their coattails because that's a bad term to use but the company is thriving because of all the individuals that are putting in the work on yeah. their own and they're pointing everybody they're pointing all their viewers to the company, to the company. Yep. Yeah. instead of the company putting out the video yeah and pointing their, trying to point them at themselves, yeah. trying to point people to themselves. Yeah. That's interesting. It's interesting to just think about, just yeah. tell you, I was like, look, I was kind of digging through. I was like, what is this, is this? okay. Well, it's not well, too it's far off from traditional skateboarding either, because if you look at like Instagram accounts, a lot of you know, the high profile skateboarders will have more followers than the companies that they ride for. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So it's, yeah. you know, it's, it falls in line with that. Which I trip on is why, you know, a lot of fucking pro skateboarders, they don't post their boards. You know what I mean? Like you don't see like a, a self-promoters. Yeah, yeah. But at the same time, to your point, mm. it's like you're, you're, you're doing this. You should be proud of it. You're pointing the, you know, letting people know the company give everybody wins when you're just like promoting your own shit. I just trip on it. Like I, I promote, I, you know, put pictures up of my shit cause yeah. I'm proud of it. And right. like, right. I don't understand why more people don't do that, you know? Yeah, do you think know. the skateboard graphics becoming like a lost art form? Kind of. Yeah. You know, it's kind of sad because it's something special. Like, you got these great artists like Sean Cliver and Mark McKee who've done the best graphics ever. Yeah. But, you know, and the, no one takes pride in having this shown on there. Well, we I talk about it a lot it. on this show, too. I think back in the, the 90s and even early 2000s, the board brand was what you wanted to have what you Absolutely. what you strive for now i think it's taking a back seat to the shoe companies and even energy drink companies so it's not it's almost like third place now where it's kind of like you don't really you don't i don't want to say you don't think about it but you still like you have so many other sponsors that you're trying to you know make happy so to speak and the ones that are cashing those big checks but what about the shop board don't you think that's really hurting the pro board sales Yes and no. I feel like it's always. I mean, kinda... I know it is a little cheaper, yeah. probably, and mm. you know, not everyone has the money to to buy a pro board, but I think it's important to support these. Pros. Yeah, it's totally. keeping the shops in business. Yeah, yeah, I understand. It's, it's tough. Like, it's a give and take and balance. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I just don't really can vibe. Like, I'm going to buy my board on Amazon. That sounds lame. Right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm sorry. I just can't. I just. I got a deal on it. Yeah. yeah, I think I mean, but the, but it's it's still like Amazon Prime now. You break your board at a spot, you Amazon a board, it, it'll be there within you know an hour. A drone drop, yeah, a drone, <laughs> drop. drone drop. Seriously, I can't wait for that to happen. Like that, caught on, like 
a session. <laughs> that would be amazing. Yeah. I just, you know, like what we were talking about the other, the last episode to this episode and then Johnny's part came out and I just thought the whole thing was super interesting of just had, you know, I thought for sure Revive had their own YouTube page, but they don't. They have no YouTube page. That's crazy. It's just, it's just individuals yeah. and they all send their viewers to that That's company, crazy. you know? Yeah. And like I said before. It, people don't need to vlog. They don't know a lot of these dudes like they do the vlogging style, you know, where they talk to the camera and they so I mean, even at the end of Johnny's part, yeah. he's yeah, talking to the camera, right. was thanking funny. everybody and this yeah. and he's been working on this. And I was just like, well, this is kind of weird, but it's kind of cool at the same time. Like he's just talking to his audience. Mm -hmm. yeah. You know, a lot of skaters don't do that. Right. Yeah. I think is that had that part ended at his last trick. I wouldn't have known that he had. 50 or however many boards coming out and what right. else he was working yeah. on and all that. Cause let's be honest, I'm not reading that description. Right. You know what I mean? And most people TLDR too long. Didn't read a right. lot of people don't read. So for him to be comfortable enough to have that sit down mm -hmm. and just like, Hey, this is coming out. This is what I'm working on. This is where you can find me. Like all that. I think that's equally as important as his skateboarding. Yeah. You know, right. you're saying that some of these guys have a follower, like two point something million followers. Mm -hmm. Maybe they'll get like some like a corporate sponsor that, hey, we'll give you this X amount. And then you just put your logo on your stuff and they can build some cool stuff and make a video out of that. Oh, totally. That's I'm what, sure what it happens, happens yeah. too. Yeah, that's I'm sure a lot of a lot. these are have paid a lot of these videos have paid partnerships mm -hmm. and stuff like that, too. You Should know, on Honey yeah. App. Yeah. 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 And these Seriously. companies drop bread yeah. for a sponsored video uh -huh. like five six figures yeah. i don't know about in, in this revive community but it's these people are throwing money at it for sure yeah it's just an it's an interesting non-traditional way mm -hmm. of doing it but it's almost becoming the traditional way in a weird way yeah it's strange you're getting, you're getting used to it it's strange yeah. you know maybe next week you're gonna get a call from bagel bites yeah. i would love that call. <laughs> please call yeah straight up love <laughs> papa john's Love the, love both of those. I'll put my bagel bites on my Papa John's. <laughs> oh. Oh, 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 yes. Oh, Damn. Yeah, like, Again, one, innovation. <laughs> Take the week off. This man's fucking out there. One thousand, Jesus. One thousand. Anyway, one thousand. Thought that was interesting. You see how beautiful that fucking place that dude lived in Switzerland. Was, like oh, yeah. his, like yeah. The, there was like a drone shot of like. I was like, what the fuck is this shit? Also, yeah. his style, I, I know I always compare skaters, and I hate doing this, but his style reminded me a lot of Ronson Lambert. Oh, a little yeah. bit, right? Like, this could have been like an FKD part back in like 2010 or yeah. something. Bro, he did some insane shit. Yeah. Like this, insane this shit. manual Casper flip out thing. Boom. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> what the fuck? Isn't that insane? How Look at that. that. I don't know, but manuals are hard. It's crazy. He's <laughs> kind of on like the borderline of like, what the fuck but then he brings it back you know what i mean like he's got like a normal he does normal tricks but he does a bunch of kind of crazy shit yeah, he was in um yeah this was nuts. double flip yeah. primo. The dude, so, so, stoked. <laughs> stoked. so stoked like i've been trying to make this for years straight <laughs> up yo that oh, face is he was in um, battle at the barracks pros versus joes too is he? yeah i mm. just cuz i remember um retta Interview him and talking about he had a heavy gur on the end of his last name. Gur. Gagger. <laughs> Very interesting, Raj. Very interesting. We went there. Even he, he even has a Patreon page, you know, which I thought was cool. Hmm. Like I don't know many skaters that have a Patreon hmm. page. You know? Good for him, man. Yeah. I don't think you need a Patreon page anymore. We don't have one. Huh. Well, we went to YouTube. We ditched our Patreon. Sorry guys. Hey, we were talking about. I think it was last episode, but like, dude, it's it's the it's the gold rush mm -hmm. of like you doing your own thing and making it work. You know, mm -hmm. what I mean? you don't have to be subject to like being a part of like a huge corporation. You can climb a ladder. Do things like you're just saying, like, oh, we don't even have that. It's like, mm -hmm. yeah, because this guy's out here fucking doing it himself. Yeah. It's right? Just, yeah, the skateboard industry catching up. Like, look at independent rappers. That right. are doing it themselves, owning their masters, and making just as much, if not more, money more. than people that are in these 360 contracts. Like mm -hmm. Tech Nine from Kansas City is one of the highest paid rappers ever, and he's been independent his whole career. Chance wow. the rapper was exactly. fucking is won a Grammy off of fucking a mixtape. Mix yeah. Like 
Jeez. the guy didn't even have you know what i mean like yeah. it's just fucking crazy but it's funny because they, they people like that like the johnny geigers and everything they're they're not wondering where their next paycheck is exactly. they're creating their own they're their creating, next paycheck. exactly, exactly. Yeah. they're saying oh well not let's let's keep this boat moving yeah, yeah let's, keep this, let's keep going down the river it's here. good yep. dude you know why climb a ladder when you can build one? It's crazy. It's, you crazy. Know? it's funny that we were just talking about this and then his part comes out. And then right? I went down the, I went down this whole rabbit hole mm. of like looking at their pages and seeing what they did. It just wasn't it's interesting. Kind of wasn't on my radar. Yeah. I mean, they've always two years ago I didn't know what Revive was. You know, now I know. But mm, I still don't know that much about mm, it. But still it, stalking them. It's interesting. Huh, Raj? Yeah. I mean, yeah, that whole thing, man. Like Chris Chan. Yeah. Kid, kid just bought a Tesla. Yeah. Who is that guy? Why is he so fucking like <laughs> he's famous? He's so good, too. Yeah, yeah and he's really so good. good. Yeah. Did you know that when Van Halen came out with their first record, they were making less than a penny? What? Whoa. Yeah. Crazy. They were getting burned to the ground. They, they didn't care. Crazy. Damn. It's in that book that their manager at the time wrote, and it's just like, the, I read that, I was like, oh. It was well, the greatest record of all time. Yeah, that's, <laughs> right? Uh, on a uh, side note, me and Eldie were having conversations off the record, and it's like perception is gnarly, because I'm sure people at that time thought they were fucking on top of the world. <laughs> on top of the world. Right. You know? Yeah, yeah, it's crazy. Fake it till you make it is real. Yeah, they didn't even have <laughs> merch when that came out, and so they yeah. were just making no money. Yeah. Crazy. And yeah. that's what this dude, the rapper dude, Chance the Rapper, he, all is, he made shit since money off merch. He mm. just fucking had the concerts and selling just shit tons of merch. Mm. And it's all coming to him because yeah. he doesn't yeah. have to fucking... No overhead. Like, <laughs> yeah. Nobody, yeah. Right? Nope. Fucking right. t-shirts. Him and the scalpers. Him and the scalpers. <laughs> him and the scalpers. There's some fake ones out there. Breaking it in. Uh, another one I thought it was really funny, Raj, was the uh, the Jankum, Matt Toma, Tomasello. Mm -hmm. Rodney Mullen. Fancy on, lad, boy. Huh? Fancy lad. Fancy lad. Mm -hmm. What uh, the? Rodney fuck? Mullen on Bath yeah. Salts <laughs> Round 3. The most fitting title ever. <laughs> the most the exact. It's fitting. so good. What was up with the board? <laughs> I feel like he works at a hardware store. Something. He's something. Or he's sponsored by like True Value. Yeah. <laughs> like the stuff he was doing was just a mind blowing and yeah. the board was flipped. It's just like, wow. And the fucked up part is he landed a lot of that shit clean as fuck. Yeah. 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 You know what? Watching some of this stuff, I was like, I had the Transformers <laughs> in my head. Yeah, I had that in my head. I was like, dude, this is, a, you know, the laser flip got. Mike coined Hayes. the laser flip Mike Hayes Mike Hayes because yeah. of the in the song the choo -choo 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 -choo, laser flip that's how, that's how I become a laser flip <laughs> did not know that he needs he, his own he needs his own transforming sounds look at that <laughs> oh shit <laughs> <laughs> oh shit <laughs> <laughs> hey? that was a deceptive. look at that <laughs> yeah dude that dude you're like skateboarding must have just been too easy for this guy yeah I mean like, look at this shit fucking, this is some fucking like that is messed up. You know? <laughs> what the heck? Like, what? We need a longer, longer sound bite. Transform. I know, but this is they transform quick, Raj. <laughs> yeah, I mean, Tom, Tom. Dude, this guy's Tom got a lot of time on his hands. It's a lot of time. And also yeah. the creation of these boards to yeah, know, the like. Fucking, what the hell's going on here? It's That is so the weird. The phone is on the wall, or camera is on the wall. Mm -hmm. And he's mm -hmm. it's springing just, it off the wall. Yeah. Oh. How do you think of this shit? Exactly. That's. <laughs> How do you think of this shit? And he's got multiple boards that do multiple shit. Yeah. <laughs> he probably made this. Probably drank that beer. <laughs> the beer. That's so the, wild. The beer in the right there. You're right there. Yeah. <laughs> drank that beer. Put that board together. And most of the tricks in this video, he filmed himself. I mean, I don't yeah. know. Like I, I don't think anyone would have the patience. I mean, I was gonna say, yeah, yeah, he spent yeah. hours upon hours it's doing a lot this of work. Shit. A lot of it. Look, look at that. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing Transformers Dude. More than meets the eye That's right Rush. <laughs> Optimus Prime He also does other cool shit too That is so skate sick park. Oh, that, that was amazing What's that one footed Wally What is that Raj so A little one footed wall ride yeah. It's amazing Yeah it's really cool Jeez. Saw this on the Nine Club Experience Instagram story Follow that if anybody's not following that, you should follow that. A lot of good stuff on there. Mm -hmm. Dang I don't understand how... What is this? Dude, it's, some of this shit just oh. looks fake. It doesn't look <laughs> real. Like it's like, Especially the slow motion shit, you're like, what? He's like being carried from something. 
just the creation of that board and then he's like okay i'm gonna do this yeah the commitment this to nipple on that. Like, yeah like dude oh my god that's like, so crazy could it just how many tries does shit like that take Ten thousand. at least <laughs> i mean manuals are difficult right you could spend there six hours six hours doing a manual how long does it take him to do this shit Making the board, first of all, probably right. takes yeah. fucking four days. Yeah, yeah. for sure. You gotta, you gotta figure, figure out the right out. trick for it. Seriously. <laughs> you know what yeah. I'm saying? And how is that, like, the metal has to be so strong for it to, like, him to still land yeah. on the board afterwards. Yeah. And mm-hmm. it just not buckle. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, what? Like, what is he doing? <laughs> this so, guy has some good shrooms dude <laughs> <laughs> fucking second that look at this bro transformers man i think it's a whole i think it's a new thing i think it's like he's got his own little decept- decepto flips or something how, you know how, many, like, <laughs> how many youtube followers does he have it's a good question it's probably a lot <laughs> i don't gonna have more after tonight yeah. all i know is that Let's see if anybody's bid on my uh, <laughs> my shirt here. Uh, no bids yet. Hmm. Damn. 250 bucks. Christian Soy, Steve Hopalero. Okay. <laughs> we'll, we'll come back to that later. We'll check on that. <laughs> it was a Jankum video, though. It was on Jankum's page. It was on Jankum's page, yeah. yeah. This one? Yeah. Damn, they do so much good shit. Mm-hmm. Uh, one of my favorites, Marvin McCoy. True Grit. Mario. 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 From humble beginnings to the world stage. Yeah. Eldie brought him up last week. I've been talking about this yeah. dude for a minute. Chris put his kickflip on the oh, list. Oh, yeah. The yeah. kickflip was amazing. Yeah. yeah. I'm a big fan. I really like this video. Yep. Yeah. This is the shit that, like, yeah, this is I a... started tearing up when his dad was, you know, yeah. 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 I was like, damn. Yeah. The you grandma. Were... Love her. So cute. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'll put your hat back on. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to kiss you. Come and, I'm going to kiss out of your face. <laughs> this is the shit I was talking about, like, for um, skate companies that started, like, yep. doing some, like, storytelling, mm-hmm. you know, and yep. using their, like, YouTube channels. Major shout out to Santa Cruz. Yeah. This was a video that, like, I didn't even look at the, the time. when Once I started it, I was just like, I, I don't want this You're to invested, end. Yeah. I was invested. Yeah. That was... It was a beautiful piece. It showed, and you know, Pennsylvania spots are very, you know, similar to Kansas City, just that whole Midwest area. Like the shit you had to skate was a fucking manhole at a curb. Yeah, <laughs> like, rugged. It's like that's real as it gets. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's good not to be scared of long form content. Yep. Yeah. You know, yeah. we need a little relaxed, chill. Yeah. yeah. Get the candle going. Boom. <laughs> you know. You know, we're not scared of it over here, bro. <laughs> <laughs> you know? We are not scared. Now nah, the storytelling, though, man, yeah. and just to see like he potentially could be representing the U.S. in the Olympics. Yeah. Oh, yeah. that'd be amazing. A kid yeah. from Reading, Pennsylvania, Reading. I'm sorry, mm-hmm. Pennsylvania. It, that's it's just that's a success story, exactly. right there. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. Seems like that. he's got his act together. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Seems like a good. Kid. He's got a good head on his shoulders. Yeah. 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 Man was saying, doesn't drink, doesn't smoke, like yeah. just yeah. fucking rips. If people put out good stuff, people are going to watch it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You know, doesn't matter if it's 20 minutes, 40 minutes, two hours. How many views yeah. did this have? I don't know. It's Not many when I put it on a list. Wow. Like when I put it on a list, I think I only had like 1,200. Shocking. This should have a lot. Yeah. 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 This really is good. the pick of the week for sure. Yeah. yeah. I love that. Yeah. And it was rad to hear from his older brother who got him into skating. Yeah, that and was just cool. Like, you know, like those stories, man. I love it. Yeah. You know who's good, White too? guy thigh. What? Sorry. <laughs> uh, Tyler Surrey's fucking really it's a good uh, segue. Yeah. Go ahead, LD. I just Keep fucking going, bro. Just big fan of that guy. Mm-hmm. I posted a clip. But, oh, that one's good too. That backside nose one was amazing. Yeah. The fucking switch frontside flip manual backside flip. Oh my god. You know, Wait, it, no, it was frontside flip switch manual. There you go. But mm. Switch backside flip. Yeah. Yeah. You know, if there was magazines still, this would be a perfect contents page. <laughs> right? With all the shit yeah. on you the side. There's yeah. so much yeah. room yeah. to yeah. put. Yeah, but enough to put them on the left page, and then you, yeah. on the right, you put your table contents. This would be really nice. That'd I like nice. this. Hold on. Let's go through the whole list again here, okay? We're going to go with this one. What, what, now, what is this? This right. could be another, either a two-page spread or another table contents. Very nice. Okay. Very nice. Now, is, <laughs> would, it, would, is, is, would somebody be stoked on a table? Is, is table contents it's good? Two, it's two pages. That's, That's right. great. Okay. It's great. It's, like a, two, it's sure. like a center spread. It's two pages. It's like the first verse in a song. Like, yeah. It's an mm-hmm. opening. Okay. Yep, it's right there. Cover. So, either it's the cover, the table of contents, or 
Center spread. Okay. There you go. So this Versace plug pocket northbound would be table of contents. Yeah. Okay. Now I know this isn't this is a screen grab of a trick. It's not really a photo, but this is a good it's a good photo. Mm. No? This no. would be in photo graffiti. Photograph. <laughs> okay. okay. <laughs> How about Miles Silvis? Whew. This could definitely be a centerfold. Centerfold, maybe yeah. cover too, kind of. The competition's mm. not, no, they no, didn't no, really shoot not. it for you. Have to kind of shoot it for a cover, right? Yeah, you, you have, have to, to be, it to be vertical. Mm. Okay, okay. Uh, what about this 917? <laughs> is this uh, one of their is this an <laughs> ad? ad? That, that could be somewhere like a hidden, Two like page ad. <laughs> something in Big Brother would be hidden, and like in the some section, <laughs> <laughs> you hold the page up to the light and it reveals. Yeah, yeah. Okay. it could be one of those those uh, things we were talking about where you got to cross your eyes yep. and find it. <laughs> yeah. and it pops oh, there out you the go. Just bring stare at it. Bring up the 3D glasses. What about this one? This is early day. This is video grab oh, sequence in Big Brother. Yeah, this would be a sequence. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it's fucking dude. That is insane. <laughs> <fucking>. <laughs> <laughs> that's to come with that too that bores. when you open up the big brother page yeah, it's, like, it's like a wooden snake yeah. <laughs> that is just messed up looking imagine if you open up a big brother to this you turn the page and then right that'd there's be incredible. a sequence that'd be amazing <laughs> Dude, so sick anyway Tyler Surrey uh, this Barcy Banks um, Barcelona Banks mm-hmm. <sighs> I've been there this this is not it is not, a, it's not, it's not yeah. easy to skate. Wow. I mean, he fucked this thing up. This thing. I think he caught his truck on he this did. one. He too. did. Yeah. He like grinded it. Wow. Boom. Oh. Which I think makes it even doper. Yeah. That's to do, uh, is that Nolly? Yeah. To do a Nolly flip. Imagine going up that bank like that yeah. and all on your toes. Yeah. And those things are like this. Yeah, they're steep. Land's pretty low too, but. <sighs> Don't matter. Gosh. That boy is good. That boy mm-hmm. good. This clip too, man. He's just. I just uh, like he goes through the bumper cars. <laughs> right. <laughs> At the end. It's a random little carnival park just yeah. in there. <laughs> yeah. What does he do? Oh, oh, <laughs> a, wow. All of a sudden, he's like a going through the bumper cars. cars. <laughs> How fun is that? He's at the Barcelona he Fair. Fucking all you have, Cam Dover. <laughs> Pretty funny. Dude, the part where. Uh, the guy did the, like the no look flip with the VX. Oh, I was yeah. really hoping that he would drop the VX and the rest of the part would be in HD. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be good. Uh, yep. Tyler Sir is really good. This is it right here. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. This... I love that he picks up his wine. Uh, yeah. Take a sip. Yeah, right. Boom. Oh, <laughs> oh, I didn't see that part for some reason. <laughs> Yeah, that like, caught my attention right away. That was crazy. <laughs> I was like, oh, you, shit. Did you think he was going to drop it, Rick? I mean, there's a good chance that he's not going to grab that. No. Yeah. But why? my question is, why is he still filming with a camera like that? Uh, it's a big debate on this show. It's, all I can it's garbage. It's Thank all I can you. Bullshit. <laughs> yes. Get with the times, guys. Yes. Put wow. that camera up on your shelf and just I, and like look at it like it's a trophy. Preach. <laughs> yes. It's a trophy, guys. <laughs> There's literally so- one behind you. Yes. <laughs> Kelly, you're not coming back. I got somebody who's yeah. on my side. <laughs> Kelly, a- stay in Brazil. Yeah. It's a whole thing. We uh, we always talk about it. We always debate. VX, HD. And they shoot good. a little too overexposed. Oh. You should shoot under a little bit. Then you can pull, pull it back. Pull a little bit, yeah. yeah. Hmm. hmm. Listen to Rick. It's a shirt. They, they got all inspired it's a by shirt. <laughs> Listen to Rick Kosick. There you go. It's a shirt. It's a shirt. <laughs> Give me a nightclub uh, yeah. special limited hey, edition. Submit your graphic to yes. our website. Rick. That'd be great. Whip, whip that up in or Illustrator. Why don't, the, why don't one of the listeners submit the graphic? There we go. Okay. There you there go. It is. Yeah. I like Listen it. Listen to Rick Cossack. Get the get the fans, you know, chiming in. That's what there we do. It is. Yeah, we do it because, first of all, we need help. We don't. We can't do all this shit on our own. Yeah. So we turn to the community. There's a lot of people out there who want to be a part of this. I know. Yeah. When we want them to be a part of it. Absolutely. You know? Yeah. Okay, we got one more clip, I think, of uh, Tyler Surrey. Because who wants more front Tyler cook? Surrey? This is... Uh, this is it. This Boom. tripped me out when wow. he did that. I was Pretty tripping on bonk. Oh, wow. That's definitely There's, big. Yeah. There's some consequences if you don't land that. <laughs> to say the least. See a Jeremy Ray spot. That was That's so like... Gnarly. 
the most SD like style at a spot like that too. Right. Like, you know? <laughs> Man, Tyler Surrey, dude. Big fan wow. of that kid. Look at that. That could be a cover. I was going to say, oh, that, that could, could be, be a, a cool cover. cover. Yeah. Oh, man. Like, if that said Big Brother at the top, it would, he would be covered. But then we, that's where Photoshop comes in. <laughs> oh. <laughs> and his head, no. his head is somewhere else. Yeah, exactly. No, but you frame it so there's enough, you know, top, you know. You, or so. you do one of those fold out ones. There you go. Maybe. Gatefold. Oh. Yeah. Centerfold. Well. Has there ever been one where it's back cover, front cover, cover? What? I don't think so. <laughs> He back knows what I'm talking about. So back it's like, yeah, a, it's like, it like this. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So you just, it's oh. like that. maybe someone has done it. Other magazines, but I've never seen it. I don't know. I think Complex used to do those. Well, mm. for a while they were doing dual covers. So you would flip the magazine over. Oh and half right, it's on the way. back. And end. I think they, I'm pretty sure they did something like that. But, mm. but a lot of times it is the fold out front fold. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And then this the switch big flip over the oh yeah Bezos, Bezos gap in Barcelona. The thing is so difficult to skate, man. It, it really is. It's funny after all this time too. This dude wow. does a fucking trick that's never been done on it. Like mm -hmm. how is that? Like, yeah. I've never been there. So is that just a skate spot or is it just just a crazy spot? It's like a skate park. Oh, I it's think a skate park. design is a skate park originally. I think they yeah. Oh, really? I think Raj is right. Try to get that clip, but uh. The, the problem with this spot is there's the bank, there's no top of the bank. Uh, so there's no point of reference of when to ollie. Right. Mm -hmm. It's just a smooth hump. Well, you could cheat and put a piece of tape down. Yeah. You, I mean, <laughs> you can, you, there is right? a sweet spot. That's true. There. There yeah. is a sweet spot. Just find your sweet spot, put the tape so you know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I like I like Tyler Surrey. You guys rips. Yeah. It's good. Look at that. Bases bump. That kid over there just chilling. Just he's hanging just out with chilling. a scooter. A scooter, scooter kid. doesn't even know what he's watching. He was probably there when B.A. did it, regular. <laughs> nah, he was a fetus when B.A. did it. <laughs> yeah, I've seen Brian Anderson. <laughs> now, what am I this? I'm talking like... <laughs> Where did that actually come from? It's a different, yeah, different yeah, country. Yeah. I've seen Brian Anderson. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah I've seen, seen him. I've seen Brian Anderson. <laughs> Wait, do why does this kid have Charlie like, Murphy's voice? I don't know. Like, <laughs> all of a sudden, he's from New York? Like, what the hell? This yeah, a, I seen that. I seen, some, I seen that. It's a habitual, oh, yeah. habitual bump. <laughs> it wasn't Barcelona accent, which it should be. All right, guys. Well, we have. Let's see this. Oh no. Okay. Well, we 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 cover this all the time, but real real you quick. Got on the line. No, real quick, Steve from Victorville. We 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 do talk about this all the time, but go ahead, bro. What do you got? Hey, how's it going, guys? Going good. I've got a question because I've been noticing something a lot lately with social media. But do uh, you think I think it's easier today to become a filmer since you know the insurrection of Instagram and Snapchat, TikTok, and all this? Uh, even though I know skating's not really on TikTok, but uh, it's so much easier to just grab your phone, take some footage, put it out there, have an endless amount of people see it. Um, do you think that does anything for anybody trying to become a filmer? Do you think it's easier, or do you still think that there's like a skill set that people are looking for as far as like going to major companies to do films? Yeah, filmer, no. Person who's on the feed, yes. Because you, yo, whoa, you are you being chased by the cops right now? What's going on? Oh no, I'm at I'm at work right now. <laughs> oh, where do you work? A hospital? I work at American Medical Response. That makes sense. Uh, well, yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. <No>. Okay. <laughs> but yeah, because, you know, social media, you never know who's looking at your page, mm -hmm. right? You could be discovered. Right. Filmer who filmed that, right. nobody cares who filmed it, right, Raj? Well, the social media aspect of it, like Instagram. No, I mean, like, if you're putting out, like, you can look at Instagram as being your real. Yeah. And you're putting out your best work. If I was like putting out like stuff I shot for like complex and hot ones, whatever else, I'm mm -hmm. sure I'd probably get phone calls like, yo, like I want to do a show, whatever, you know, but you delete your shit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so they go on your page and you're like, this guy has nothing here. Yeah. He's a ghost. <laughs> I see what you're saying though. Yeah, That's you, a good you, look you at yeah. your real. Right. You know, okay. And work that you've done. Yeah. What do you think about that? Steve? Yeah, I definitely agree with that. Uh, just because, I mean, I'm I'm an older guy. I came I came from like filming my friends on like high eight tapes and stuff like that, or like mini DV and all that. And become like trying to film and put stuff out and see people get people to see it was like impossible back then because I think YouTube 
back when I was doing it was just coming up. So like nobody could really see it um, unless you showed your friends or whatever. And they didn't really care. But now, uh, you know, it's, it's everywhere. And there's skaters everywhere now. And it's in your face everywhere. With, uh, and cameras are on every single device we have pretty much these days. So It's a wild, wild just, west, Steve. It's a wild, wild west. <laughs> it definitely is. The world is your oyster. You just is. have to go for it. Yep. Yeah. Build your own ladder. Yeah. Are you on TikTok, Steve? Wow. I'm not on TikTok. You know what's funny? funny I listen to your guys. No. Oh. I think I'm too old for that. Okay. Nobody's going to find me funny. All right. But it's funny because you guys talked about it on that episode where you were talking about put skating on TikTok or make it funny or whatever. And I actually looked it up. I, I couldn't find shit. Yeah. Well, you got to know who to follow. To on that. It's, yeah. a, it's it's a whole. It's like Instagram. If you just sign up for Instagram, you'd who do I follow? You yeah. know, you would know maybe celebrities or people you're fans of. But TikTok's more. You got to find those people who are funny. Like for Vine, it was like King Batch and mm-hmm. these other mm-hmm. Viners. Who, if you just went on Vine, you wouldn't really know who to look for. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So you kind of got to be in the know for that. Right, and I don't even know how to navigate TikTok <laughs> yeah. properly to be able to find anybody. Look, look up Mike Cossack. He's it, on TikTok. He posts funny shit all the time. Is he on TikTok? <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> not yet, anyway. <laughs> Listen, I believed you there for a second. I was like, oh, shit. Yeah. He does great dance videos. <laughs> oh, yeah. He, he does good lip syncing, too. Yeah. Hey, I can see it. But, uh, all right, Steve. Well, listen, go get back to work, bro. People probably need your help. <laughs> And get to work. Make nah, some videos. But yeah, all right. For sure. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, get out there, Steve. <laughs> all right, guys. I appreciate you guys so much. I, I really do appreciate everything you guys have done for the skate community, really. Thank you, Steve. Thank we you. appreciate you. Thank you for the support. Awesome. You guys have a good night, and I'll catch you guys next time, hopefully. Right. Okay. Talk later, later, bro. Peace. <laughs> all right. Bye. 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 All right. We got a raffle. We got a raffle. We got a raffle. We got a raffle. We got New Balance stuff. This is great. I'm surprised. Should we dress LD up? Oh, go ahead, LD. You want to get dressed <laughs> up? Right? You got a hoodie, a shirt, and uh, that's how, you, some how it looks. Let's see how people. Let's see how. Uh, yeah. <laughs> show people. Here's a shoe too. Put that on your head. Where does a hat? Oh God! Don't spill that beer, Raj. That is. Oh just, boy. That is just, it's definitely empty. Bad idea. Shout out Look at that. LD's we got a beer over That's here. actually a great looking you like that? hoodie. Shout out to LD for pulling over a zip up hoodie. Hey, yeah. <laughs> Didn't even see the zipper. <laughs> you know, Look fall you. starts tomorrow. Yeah, there you go. This is That's a pretty a good, good. Put uh, the shirt around your neck like you're going to go to the gym or something. What, the fucking <laughs> yeah. this thing? Yeah. Oh, like, put that around you. Yeah. There you go. Got... Yeah. There you go. Yeah, it's pretty good. That's usually how people wear their That's shit. Normally, how I yeah. wear my shoe when I go to the gym. That's huh? you driving down the street right there in your car. Your shoe phone. Going to McDonald's. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Let's have Rick do the honors yes. of yeah. uh, picking oh, three winners for this nice New Balance package. We're picking names out the shoebox. Ooh, no, we're that. picking name out of, names out of the Homer's <laughs> Home Depot bucket. I'll pick, but Steve just calls it out. All right, go Deal. ahead, bro. Just pick three of them, Rick. Three winners. All right. Dig deep. Hey, I love when going. you have Daniel on the episode when you couldn't even see him when you had the bucket right here. <laughs> 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 I was laughing so hard. All right, so. Three winners. Here goes Rick. I mean, Rick. do you guys do this every week? You cut these up once a week? or yeah. is it- Usually Kelly yeah. does it, but he's out of town, oh, so yeah. Raj had to do it. All right. I've done it too. Yep. You know, it's, it's hard work. <laughs> Here's one. Here's one. There we go. There's Don't one. I know what it is yet. Nope, not yet. Okay. Okay, making this fair. Yep. There's two. There's two. two. Oh, people are getting excited. Oh, I know. <laughs> yes. And oh, oh, I picked two on accident, so I'm gonna. <laughs> yeah, I agree, Kelly. There you go. All right. <laughs> Three lucky winners for the New Balance prize package. Tyler Surrey shoes. We just watched a bunch of clips yeah. of Tyler Surrey's. Amazing. You can do nollie flips at Barcelona Banks. Please. Oh my God. Give you me a drum shoes. roll. Yes, drum? We yes, we do. Yes, we do. Here we go. Well, usually we, we wait for the last the one. Last the last one? Oh, okay, okay. All right. Go ahead, Jesus. First one. First winner. We've got Sleepy Monkey 714. Ooh, Ooh Sleepy Better wake up. Monkey 714. Did they write anything? No message. Okay. Um, I'm having a hard time with this name. Mm. It's 
Do we need to pick another name? It's a little tough <laughs> for me to uh, to say. Uh oh. So I'm just gonna spell it. Oh, shit. The What's winner going on, is man? capital N space G N E R. Oh. Wow. Just gonna leave that there. Okay. And <laughs> wow. wow. Hold on, Steezus. Here's a drum roll. Oh, I'm ready. Cannibal Social Network. Cannibal Social Network. Look at that. Right. No, no, no messages from any of these No guys. messages. Okay. So we got Sleepy Monkey 714 in space G-N-E-R and Cannibal Social Network. Cannibal. Please send a copy of your receipt to the Nine Club at the Nine Club dot com. <laughs> yeah. <I could. laughs> We've been doing this for so long, I've never had to say it. What is it? Con- contest. contest at the nine club.com. Screenshot of your receipt and your address and your size. Raj will take that email, forward it over to New Balance. They will then, in turn, send a box directly to your house. You're going to feel sponsored. It's going to be great. You know, give this to Raj over there. She's comfy. Come, oh, he's already. Oh, you've already taken it all off. Yeah, I took it all off. Okay. It's hot in here. Email us nine cl- uh, contest at the nine club dot com. Screenshot of your receipt. I already said all this. Yeah. Don't need mm-hmm. to say it. Again. There you go. Perfect. Rick Kosick. Yes. The man. Thank you so much. The legend. Yeah. Thank you for having me on, bro. Appreciate this it. This has been. So- everybody in the audience has enjoyed. You. <laughs> here. It's been incredible. <laughs> Even the uh I'm a skater. No, even the old fucking transformer. <laughs> Boom. Look at that. Maybe Kelly thought I was funny just a little bit. Kelly thinks everybody's funny. <laughs> <laughs> That's not to take anything away from your humor. You are a very, very funny individual. Thank you. <laughs> hey, we enjoyed having you here, bro. This is great. Yeah. Well, I had a blast. Oh, thank you for the gift, the shit book. Yeah. yeah. It's awesome. yeah. Bring that back. Bring that back over here, Steve. Look, at, Jesus. look at that. End of the show. Now, should we unwrap that? Yeah, I mean, well, it's, it's I covered. Don't know. I don't you're know. trying to send, you're trying to sell it on your eBay account. I, yeah. You know? That's what I know I'm you, saying. I, like, I know you like to sell used things on your, your well, eBay. This is brand new. This is. This I, I see this book right here on that shelf over there. That's, that that's, look good. Will it right fit? There, right. That's a big book, Rick. I don't know if that'll fit in the cubby. I mean, you can take down that Tim Gavin. Measure that. Jesus, what is that? Is that about? <laughs> There's an app for that. How does that work? I have the measuring app too. You, we all have the measuring app. What do you mean? Wait no, a minute. No. So you take that. You it's literally an app called Measure that comes on your phone. Really? I have a other a different. Wait, wait. So you take you ruler. Take a photo of it, and it. How does it? I have right. ruler. You got to move the phone ruler. to start, so I can pick it up. Okay. Right. And then you point the dot on the corner. Yeah. Are we we going have this app. Don't, don't go diagonal. Yeah, you're measuring you're right, out you're a right. TV. Boom. 12 by. Oh my God. 12 by 12. 12 by 12. Uh, LD, measure out one of those cubbies real quick. Uh, I guess you learn something every day. Yeah, measure out a cubby. (laughs) Well, I got this like, there's about five inches. (laughs) There's about. Oh, it's about 10. (laughs) Dated technology. We got it's, it's, it's about 10 by 10, it's about 10 by 10. If we didn't have a smartphone, what would you do? Right? Yeah. Uh, we would have to find a tape measure around yeah. this. Yeah. <laughs> so it's 10 by 10, judging by your primitive I don't iPhone. Know. App. I Definitely feel like 10, it's this that, one. But that. Jesus, uh, can Gavis, you register it from there? It's, it's probably, a little too far away. Oh. That Gavin um, yeah. cereal box is taller than this. Let's see here. It's going to fit. Unbelievable. You could stick it behind that Hello Kitty. Oh, Lord. Look at this. <laughs> Try the box behind you. Are these the same? Yeah. yeah that. It's definitely going to be 12. I think okay. it'll fit. Let's oh, see. I'm going to find this surface here. I got, it, I got a point. I'm going to add that point right there. And I'm going to go down here. How do you... And I'm going to add this point right here. What do you know? No, that's 12 it. and a half. 12 and a half. Yep. Elders, you got to get a new app. Got just Jesus. enough. I need to re reinstall. It's the it same app as oh, it used to be. The level, and then they added the ah, the measure technology, bro. My phone Crazy. space is like a fuck. 
I want to thank all of our sponsors, New Era Independent Trucks, OJ Wheels. Man, they are amazing. They're great people. You ever gonna drink that milk? Huh? You ever gonna drink that milk? No, I just had this here in memory of Kelly. Uh. Yeah. <laughs> Kelly, you know. That's why his mouth's so juicy. juicy. Yeah. <laughs> Causes phlegm. <laughs> <laughs> Also to our Giphy and graphics page on our website. If anybody has any ideas, throw us, throw them out to us. You know, Do yeah, throw a little, upload them. upload them. Throw a little il- Illustrator. Throw a little PNG. You know, there's stickers. There's gifts. There's graphics for mugs and shirts and all kinds of stuff. You know, if you we feel the, huh? We could use it. Yeah, one thousand shirts, one thousand mugs. Listen to Rick Kosick. Yes. I don't know Love if, that I don't know if that'll make it yeah. in our line, but uh, no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> a limited edition limited club ed- spe- experience only. Yeah. Oh. There you go. Listen to Kosick. Anyway, I think that'll be fun. I think it'll be fun to see some community. Yeah. yeah see what people want to submit. Yeah. It's an awesome idea. Yeah. Awesome, sure. right? Yeah. You know? I like it. Yeah, people uh, people want to get involved, and we're telling them, hey, come right in. Let's yeah. do this, yeah. you know? Uh, Steezus. Yes, sir. Any last words? I feel like you guys are forming a little bromance over there. Bro, you say, yeah. Are you guys going to go get dinner? Or? I mean, this corner, it's it smells delightful. You guys yes. are going to go candle shopping. We're living our best life over we here. Are, <laughs> we are. That's the only way to do it, you know? It's, it's, been, a, it's been a pleasure having you here. Yeah, thank you. I've had from, a good time. Yeah, from a fan of your work. And, I'm a fan and of yours, too. So the feeling is mutual. I don't have much work, but uh, I appreciate no. the sentiment. No, no, but I like I like your guys' chemistry. It's great. Well, I was going to ask, Rick, what? What, what is it about Steezus that you really enjoy on the show? I like his positivity. Oh, yeah? Mm-hmm. What do you think? I, I'm just negative all the time? What's going on? No, no, no. That's my, that's my job. <laughs> oh, that's, not, that's Roger's job, yeah. <laughs> he, brings, he just brings the positive vibes. Okay. Thank you. Man. Okay. I appreciate it. I try to. And I apologize. I haven't been able to see your eyes this whole time because the camera... Um, screen thing there we oh, are right. now i can see you the whole time i'm like <laughs> looking at his mouth and nose i'm sure he's looking, at the, he's looking at the same thing for me hey it is what it is, it is, what it is. Know, cameras come first yep. exactly. and, oh yeah. also thank you for backing my disdain for vx 1000 footage in 2019 yeah i'm over that <laughs> <laughs> yeah it's time to hang it up guys move on there's a lot of great Cameras out there you can film with. Yeah. Listen, listen to Rick. Ri- Fuck. It's a tongue twister. <laughs> listen to Rick Kosick. There said it is. And I could have said it. <laughs> Maybe you even got a soundbite tonight, Rick. We don't know yet. Well, you know, we'll have to run back ooh. the tape and see. Well, if it, if it happens, it happens. <laughs> He'll be in the chat next next week. Yeah. 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 He'll hear his yeah. voice like, oh shit. Yeah, I'd be honored. <laughs> it might even be shit. <laughs> <laughs> could be. <laughs> Ah, shit. Anyway, I mean, we have, I mean, you. White guy thigh. Why is that a sound bite? We don't know, but it works, you know? Mm. We saw a guy lathering up his thighs uh, yesterday. Yeah, at the Claremont thing. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> so he, we lathering. walked by, he was full going for Just his like thighs. Just covering his thighs. We're like, white guy thigh. So yeah. LD's bringing awareness. <laughs> I, hey, that's that, what I'm saying. We're just trying to help over here. I said LD would be so proud right now. <laughs> guy is lathering. <laughs> Raj, any last words for last words? anybody? No? Yeah. Uh-huh. Bryce never has <laughs> first or game. last words. He just, he's it's just here. Okay. It's okay. I'm just, uh, you know, LD. Uh, I'm always scared to ask it, but okay. Uh, any last words, LD? I have a few. <laughs> <laughs> Heirloom tomatoes. So that was, that was last week. <laughs> no, uh, I just want to give a, a, a shout out to, I did, uh, I have a golf company mm. and we did a, sh- a shoe collab with an amazing shoe company, Handmade Shoes. We uh, kind of did a soft launch at this place called Malbun Golf. It's on Fairfax. I'm actually going to do uh, our own party that we kind of piggybacked off of his party. Mm. Uh, he was launching his uh, cut and sew line and piggybacked off him, had an f- amazing turnout. And um, nonetheless, who showed up was fucking Skate Cho. 
OG skate show. With his GoPro? <laughs> With his GoPro. <laughs> rich OG skate show. Yeah, Rich was there and he was How the- How did he ma- know about it? Dude, and I fucking Instagrammed it like two hours before the thing. I wasn't even going to because it wasn't my party. I was just kind of mm. like see how it worked, you know? Okay. And fuck it, I did it. And this dude shows up with his wife. Wow. Mind you, there was liquor at the party. Him and his wife brought a cooler, fucking full of beer, and just went and like he brought boards for me to sign. But he was he's a golfer. He like, likes golf too. But uh, did he know he was going to a shop? It sounded like he's going to a barbecue. Yeah, I, w- I like. <laughs> That's how he rolled. I, I, yeah, I, dude, I, I, I complimented. I, I was like, dude, I'm so hyped on you and your wife right now. Bring a beer here, like just in case maybe you, <laughs> you couldn't get beer here. They were down to kick it, like okay. straight up. But he was just the event went amazing. But um, they cook too. Uh, they had a, a pizza and sandwiches. Stuff. Yeah, oh, okay. sandwiches. Um, but just to the point we always talk about, like, it was really cool. He was just like, we broke down and he was Sick. just like, this show has brought like life to his skateboarding again. And like, he was just like, just so just loved what we, he took a 10 year hiatus from skateboarding oh, wow. and like this show got him to skate again. Right. And it's just like really cool to hear that wow. from somebody and how like just listening to us makes people want to skate. That's cool. So yeah. I That's just really want cool. to give him a shout out, Malbun Golf, Community Made, all that shit. Like, there you go. Yeah. When are your shoes going to be out? So they, they, they're they available for pre-order right now on Community Made's uh, website. How much are they? They're 250 bucks. Wow. Yeah. Well, you know what? If I sell my eBay shirt. There you go. Boom. <laughs> you can get a pair. No, but they... they uh, you order them and they hand make them. There, uh, there is no yeah, like. They're not there. Look at like, stock. Nothing. You order it, whatever size you get. You, they make it and they send it to well, you. Well, what's the time on that? How long does it take? They were f- fucking really fast. Like you can do it now. Well, they said if they get a lot of orders, if you do it now, they'll be to your door November first. So like a month, give or take. Okay. I mean that's not bad for yeah. custom made shoes. No, they, they're turnaround. I just is, did some custom vans. How long like, like, like two weeks. Yeah, two th- weeks. their turnaround is like two weeks. Yeah. If like you were gonna make go into their store, you could you could get a shoe. In now, what happens weeks. if you order? They, say I ordered a ten and a half. I got them. Um, they're too small. So they have a return policy, and they oh. it, they're pretty true to form. They're great leather. It's it's an, a fucking amazing shoe, hmm. um, and. They're amazing. Community made. They're located downtown um, in the arts district, and they're all about giving back to the community. So if you order a shoe, they have a thing where like uh, a percentage of your order, the money that you spent goes to any uh, charity that you want. So they have picked out like their favorite charities Mm -hmm. but if you they have like a thing you fill out and you can pick from yeah they have a list but you can do your own if you have one you want whatever you spent on the shoe some of it will go to a charity interesting yeah it's it's an amazing fucking they they kill it okay yeah how much are you paying you i i'm not making any money at all because i told them i was like you know what they i walked in let me try to do your deal (laughs) (laughs) i walked into there and the guy skated yeah. And like he was, no, just, you've told us about this yeah. in the past. Yeah, you, wanted, yeah. you wanted us to do a collab with and them. And they will do it. Like, yeah. this is like just treading water. Like, we're trying it out. You know what I mean? No, it's cool. It fits, it's right up your alley. It, I mean, it would be cool for us to have custom made shoes, but it's more, it's, it's, it fits you. Yeah. 1,000. 1,000. Percent. Percent. Yeah. But, uh, a button for that. shout out to K Nuts. <laughs> No, I like that they're doing something. It's community made, but they're also giving back to. The That's their whole shit. Choice. Yeah. yeah, it's it's awesome. And, and so I'm gonna. Amer- and it's made in America. It's made in L.A. Oh wow. Yeah, they don't Amazing. they don't want to they don't do nothing overseas nothing. It's all mm, here. Super cool. fucking comfortable shoes, oh. man. It's amazing. Yeah, it's really good. Well, good luck, man. I hope you sell a uh, couple hundred pairs. Well, thank you. I mean, I could say thousand, couple thousand. No, pairs. dude, we. I hope thirty three would be a great okay. number to sell. <laughs> okay. Yeah, it's amazing, dude. Uh, let me check on my eBay shirt real quick. Uh, no, no bids yet. No. Hmm. I don't know the if that price just yet. Well, Andy Max. Well, it's live on eBay. You're gonna have to do a follow up on this next week. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Rick, I will. Trust me. I'm gonna check my eBay account here. What's the thirty three right there for? I don't know. I like that. Yeah. That's how many ratings you've gotten. It's a perfect so, one. So it's gotten 28 views so far, Raj. In, uh, Any comments? 
No. I'm scared to look at the comments. Like, what the fuck are you doing selling this bullshit? <laughs> <laughs> Have you done like a Twitter blast on this so all your you know followers can find it? No. I'm just kind of letting it organically go until the show airs. And yeah. then probably like Rich Skate Show might buy it. <laughs> Very <laughs> I'm hoping. I also just noticed that there's a sponsored post that is going for six thousand dollars. Thirty Hall of Fame autographs. Wow. Whoa! Oh. <laughs> six thousand dollars. Who, who's that? Seriously. Let's check this out. Looks like he's on a whiteboard. But it's not a stinky shirt. <laughs> it's on a Miller whiteboard, made the American way. <laughs> well, I guess that's kind of cool. Who are these people? I don't know, but they're autographed to Dave. <laughs> Go Dave, best wishes. <laughs> so you got to be named Dave in order to buy this. <laughs> Sparky Anderson. Oh, they look like a baseball player. Right? Mike Ditka, basketball, uh, a football player. <laughs> the Bears. Any other? Uh, Walter Dick, Payton. <laughs> Wait, Dick Night, Night Train, Train Lane. Lane. <laughs> <laughs> Love that. No, no bids yet, though. This item is one badass. <laughs> yes. yes. Badass, badass is two words in this contest. <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, well, I just hope mine goes for 250 I think you'll get it. Yeah, I think you, yeah, for sure. Yeah. Somebody has forfeited their right to donate to our chat tonight, and they have <laughs> bid yeah. on your... Yeah. Christian Hasoy and Steve Hopalero autographed chocolate shirt. <laughs> Hopalero. His words, not mine. His words. Hopalero. Love that he's running with it. Anyway, Eldry. Eldry, yep. thank you so much for coming by. We appreciate you all the time. I'll be I here think next last, week. last week you were a fan favorite with the heirlooms and the, uh, the uh, bread toasting in the oven. Cooking. Broiling. Cooking's yep. cool. Yeah, yep. yep. like yep. cooking. We'll see what you are this week. Maybe this week nobody likes you. I think Rick, I, <laughs> especially with someone like Rick here. Yeah. What's that? You're the You're fan, fan favorite. favorite. You might Aww. be the fan favorite this week, Rick. Maybe. Yeah, I don't sure. know. It's up and down, Raj, right? I don't a lot of weeks, people uh, are fan. It's usually me. Usually, yeah. God, I don't <laughs> Team know. You Raj. Got a, you got a lot of weird ones last week. You were in a bad mood. <laughs> Steezus, thank you so much for uh, doing what you do, keeping the positive vibe, you know, always love it. Thank you, man. Thank you for having me. I'm glad to be a part of it. Shout out to all our fans, our supporters, and, and people that rock with us. We couldn't be here without you. 1,000. Rick, <laughs> thank you so much. for You got your hand on that button. I think you really want to push it. <laughs> we disconnected for the people who uh, sit in for us. but uh, It's making me antsy over here because I just want to know what it's really like to be... Kelly to be Kelly. Yeah. <laughs> plug in? I should have plugged it in. We didn't plug it in. Ah, well, maybe next time you come back, we'll plug it in. Okay. Sounds yeah. like a deal. Uh, Raj, thank you for being you, bro. Thank you, bro. Hey, thank, thank you, always, Chris. Thank you. Thanks Appreciate for showing that. up. Appreciate that. Should I do another, uh, should I blow up the computer? Let's do it. Blow it up. I'm a skater. <laughs> <laughs>